Okay, we're going live now. And it worked this time. Okay. Great. Now, now, yeah. now we're live. Now it's happening. see that it worked this time. Yes. Oh, now that, that nothing the, has changed. That is, yeah, that is the theme of tonight. You just try it a second time and it works. Anyway, we're here, guys. That was Hooray. confusing and kind of annoying, but that's fine. Yeah. Myriad tonight, te technical that difficulties. Is, that is fine, because tonight is all about being chill and being mm -hmm. heckin' mm -hmm. cute. Heckin'. I'm into it. Heckin'. Heckin'. Uh, yeah, Flippin'. so... I believe we should be live if somebody else can check chat for me. Usual constraints of Yeah, I have my eye on it. More or less unable to check chat. People are saying hello, so I think at the very least they should be able to hear us. Cool. Wow. Uh, if we could do a, an audio test for the <laughs> lovely people at home, that'd be great. <clears throat> Jackson. Hello, I'm, I'm the GM. Uh, yeah, no, tell me how I sound. This is going to be my normal volume. It you gotta be able to hear him. The rest of us don't really matter, but you gotta be able to listen to the GM. It's very important. And yeah, uh, hi, I'm not the GM, but hopefully you can still hear me. Yes. Matt's a lot louder than the others. That's... Mm. That's weird. Weird. Yeah, I haven't changed any of my settings. Um... You guys are seeing chat ahead of me. How the yeah. Hell? Oh yeah, me too. How did you do that? Are you guys in the future? Yeah, I have no idea. Um, if that's a little louder, I can turn it down a tad. a little louder? Ooh. Yeah, if that's bad, no, no, no. feel free to turn me down some. No big deal. Honestly, you sound pretty much fine to me, but that's that's, that's okay. just, that's just yeah, my I don't point. know why it would be different for the stream, but... Yeah, I, I, I turned, you, I turned you down a smidge. All right, okay, okay. Uh, okay, and I am Fast. I am going to be playing Quithup. Let me know how I sound. Everyone sounds fine. Cool. I think okay. What about right. me? Do yeah, I sound Jackson? fine? This is Jackson. Hi. Perfect. Cool. Excellent. Uh, great. Awesome. Okay, cool. So <clears throat> that should be good enough to start. Should we wait while people filter in or do our usual crap or just jump right in? Uh, let's see. Uh, let's, we give can it, wait let's give it we a, can minute. Wait a minute. But we're, we're a little yeah. delayed, so let's... Yeah. Uh, Let's give it. Let's give it a minute. But like, it's it's rising pretty quickly. So yeah. I think we can get going in a minute here. Yeah, I'm sorry, Chad. Uh, I accidentally deleted all of my scenes from OBS. This is like normally it's it's cooth to blame the program, but I have to blame myself this time because it was my fault and OBS did nothing wrong. I hate as much as it burns me to admit that, and neither oh, did you two. No. Yeah. You know, you didn't have to admit that either. You could have just lied. Yeah. I know. I would have lied. It's it's just like, Faust and Jackson have been, like, fucked over so many times by YouTube streaming <laughs> or uh, Twitch's streaming that, like, uh, I, I feel like you... if I piled on, it'd be plausible, but not necessarily mm -hmm. truthful, because this was my well, fault. at least you're honest. Yeah. At least I'm honest. <laughs> And isn't that what tonight's stream is all about? Is Honesty it? and the goodness in everyone's heart? Yeah, if you're trying to call the theme beforehand, you're doing a good job because you're casting the <laughs> widest possible man. I sure am. <laughs> and isn't that? <laughs> and isn't that? <laughs> oh, man. So, how's it going, chat? <laughs> I can't really respond to chat we're, in yeah. real time, we're, but yeah. I, I figured I might as well throw the question out and get responses in 30 seconds. Yeah, everyone having says, a, good, uh, a good Saturday night? It's Saturday, right? I'm it's not it's probably Saturday. It's definitely Saturday, yeah. yeah. Double checking everything. Probably, yeah. I'm, I'm just, I'm a little out of it because I've been streaming a lot lately and I'm pretty sure I, I caught whatever dank disease was rocking Fost. Sorry. So I oh, can, no. I'm, I'm desperately trying to get all no. of my work done before it hits me like a hurricane. Oh, uh, no. hey, fingers crossed you didn't, you didn't catch it. Speaking yeah. of that, are you feeling better, Fost? More or less, yeah. Good. Good. I still got some of it gunking around. But yeah, for the most I'm part, on the tail end of a cold myself. It's a fun time. <clears throat> but yeah, um, last night, uh, last night we actually streamed over on my channel. Um, uh, a module by a friend of mine, um, Christian, made this really good, uh, five E campaign that we had a lot of fun with. Mm -hmm. Um, 
If you wanna, oh, nice. if you wanna see like shenanigans, maybe with a group of people who uh, you don't see every time. I mean, I guess Pip and you Will are there. Uh, so <laughs> yeah, if you've seen anything with me, they're they're always there generally. So like, check it out on my channel. It is it is really good and fun, and that's all I'll say about it. It's it's a good time. If if you've got a thirst for content. I, I have don't. a thirst for... You oh. don't? <laughs> no thirst for content. <laughs> oh, sorry to cut you off. Tell us about your thirst for content. I have a thirst for content. <laughs> okay. Tell me more. <laughs> That's all. Oh, okay. <laughs> like original content or like lemon lime content or what's, OCs. what's good? I, okay, I'm nice, all about nice. those OCs. There are many good OCs in this. Original so sense. There are many that. good OCs. <laughs> this whole thing is OCs. Do you ever think about that? Think no. about it. You ever think about think that? Think about it. Think about that every day. <laughs> yes. So uh, for this... I think that would be a good time to start. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no. I, I desperately want to move off of whatever topic this is. Um, okay, so this is technically session two of our um, uh, Ryutama campaign. Uh, I have titled it Ryutama Golden Sky. Wow, nice. Mm. That's really yeah. good. Uh, as like Thanks. a title for the entire campaign or just this session? Uh, I don't know. It can let's, be not, let's not say anything now in case we come up with a better one. Yes. Like Ryutama Look truck. inside your heart and you'll find the answer there. What was that, Jackson? <laughs> <laughs> chat, chat, let us know if you find anything good in your heart. Yeah, or come up with a good name for us. Regardless, this is... um. This is already content, I'm thirsty. This is the second uh, <laughs> session of our Ryutama campaign. Um, it technically began with uh, a Golden Sky Story session that functioned as a sort of prequel. It's being cut and put up on the channel if you want to see it week by week. However, if you want to catch up, um, it's it's not super important. Ryutama is thankfully not like... It's chill. It's not the most mm -hmm. narratively taxing. Uh, system out there. You don't. You don't need to understand. Like you don't need to see the last session to find out how the Broomtail got all of those hand grenades or something. Um, Wait. Yeah. No. <laughs> I was. I was using a negative, an example in the negative, as in it is not an example of that. As in Broomtail okay. will not have hand grenades. I didn't say that. But. Yeah. Um, okay, I'm out. I'm, I'm <laughs> uh, this is too much for me. Uh, I'm yeah. not emotionally prepared for her to have hand grenades. Yeah. Regardless. Uh, <laughs> we're uh, we're launching in with the second session where the group just agreed to help out this um, small town called Wayward uh, that is, has hit some rather tough times. Confusingly, the only way to aid the town is to write in a book called a travel log. Uh, it's functionally a chronicle of your adventures, of all the people you've made and all the sights you've seen. Travel logs, based on their detail and how much emotion is poured <laughs> into them, can grant different powers to the both the Ryujin and the seasonal dragons they serve. Think of it like this. Uh, the players, <laughs> by going out into the world and experience thing, uh, experiencing things, are like farmers uh, going out and collecting crops. The Ryujin is then like the chef or other restauranteer mm -hmm. preparing the food who then presents it to the seasonal dragons who are the consumers who consume these travel logs and rain their blessings their very confusing blessings down upon the world <laughs> um yeah what if we lie uh <laughs> well they know yeah unfortunately like God, they have, like truth sense. Not they won't always know is the thing. If you're good enough about uh, lying, you can okay. like. If you were, if you were say, so saying, we oh, could maybe get a we could maybe get away with small lies. Well, no. If you were like a really famous like author that maybe made up a thing or two about your travels, like a one dragons a plenty, you could probably get away with <laughs> lying. But like, you should only really attempt this if you're really confident in your ability of, uh, to deceive through fiction. No. So like, that would totally saying, not be a character for me. Yeah. No, we're not. You're yeah, saying we, we shouldn't like here. full Gilderoy Lockhart it, but we can try. You can certainly, you can try. I wouldn't recommend it is what I'd say. I don't, I don't Depends. think it's a character for any of us to do that. No, actually. that's, that's the big thing. too dumb to lie. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, as a quick introduction to our party, um, uh, Matt, who are you playing? Oh, I am playing uh, Liotta Tarlish. She is basically a wanderer who was just kind of 
going out into the world to see new and interesting things and write about it in her journal. She was pretty thrilled that, uh, that, uh, you know, somebody wanted her to actually just like do that, but in a slightly more official capacity. So yeah, she's just interested in meeting new people, seeing cool things and advertising ye old family noodle, noodle restaurant back home. <laughs> Excellent. Jackson, Simple who are you person. playing? I'm playing Jasmine. She is a, uh, Traveling healer, an herbalist. Oh, oh, I can switch the loading screen to actually show Jasmine. Whoa! Whoa! That's awesome. And you're probably seeing her right now. Yeah, good job. Or shortly. And, uh, yeah, she's just a nice person, I think so. And she's kind of joining up with this group unexpectedly. <laughs> she got off her, they house. her a house. Yeah, they yeah. gave her a house. <laughs> um, and then finally, Quithup. I mean, Faust. <laughs> <You're> playing. <laughs> I'm playing Quithup. Quithup is a fox spirit, uh, and he's, he's too dumb spirit? to lie. Isn't, he? Isn't that Wait, what the what? foxes are? No, he's just a fox normal. <laughs> I thought the fox... No, okay. Resend. Rewind. <laughs> I, I that's what all the foxes were. That that is That is stepping far and above what Quithup would ever know. Oh, true. I guess I was speaking from a world hmm. perspective. Yes. Anyway, get him, rewind. Yeah, rewind to this. I'm Quithup, and I'm too dumb to lie. <laughs> <laughs> and that's all you need to know. <laughs> uh, okay, and um, I'm the GM. Today I'll be playing all of the NPCs, except for the one that's played by Matt. Um, and uh, I'll... Wait, what? Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> no, there's a, there's a very important NPC. Um... <laughs> Uh, and I'll be playing, pr uh, in particular, Ari Ark and Broomtail in this. Uh, the group managed to pretty much recruit Broomtail just by being <laughs> charming. And you'll see her on screen right now. She's uh, similar wow. to her, yes, Whoa. a fox-type person. Um, but yeah, with uh, with no further ado, would you guys be cool with starting? Yeah, I'd like to yeah. start. Long. I'm sure everybody has, has expected us to start already. Yep. So, okay. uh... So your map is still in the upper left of the screen, I should point out. Uh, you can add to it whenever you feel like. Where? Um, Where? I'm, not, I'm on a different map, actually. Oh, whoops. Back to the loading screen. Right now, <laughs> I still have helpful information about certain stony creatures. Oh, yes, yep. you're on the museum. Map. There it is. Sorry, I've started okay. adding mini-maps to my adventures. You do the drawing this time. My drawings are atrocious. <laughs> <laughs> Matt, go. your drawings are beautiful. Yeah, they're great. <laughs> Uh, yeah, no, uh, I'm leaving the group entirely in charting, um, in charge of charting their own expeditions, and at the very end of this, hopefully, we'll have one big dumb map we can all laugh at and enjoy. <laughs> Regardless, your group, if you remember, uh, went to sleep under no. the stars. Uh, a great grove extended overhead, uh, tree, uh, sunset hime ha apples hanging from all of the trees. I don't know exactly how you all fell asleep, but, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you all wind up with a very, very good night's rest. And you wake up hey. in the morning alongside the birds. You really have no choice because birds are flocking all over this grove. They're pecking at the apples and many of them fall, uh, striking the ground next to you. Thunk. <laughs> what? <laughs> Oh, goddamn sky rats. Get out of here. <laughs> Is Liana not a morning person? Liana doesn't like animals. <laughs> 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 what? Oh, I love that. Uh, one by one, you rise okay. in response to the great clamor in the clearing. <laughs> oh. Oh, 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 I look, guess it's morning then. Yeah, well, Ugh. look, Jasmine, your oh, your new house comes with lots of um, uh, hmm, what kind of bird is that? Uh, Broomtail kind of stares up at the gathering. That looks like a blue-tailed crow type thing. Does anybody know animals? No, <laughs> I've noticed Quith Quithup is missing. <laughs> sort of. Do you, how much do you not know animals? Um, I know that they fly, and I know that they like eating pretty much anything. Some of them, yes. <laughs> oh, look, it's pooping that now. Works. How wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what about what, what about these ones, Jasmine? Do these uh, is is there something special about them? Oh, those burrowing things—they ruin plants. 
I'm gonna have to get rid of those. <laughs> These birds burrow. Oh, that's <laughs> kind of interesting. <laughs> yeah. yeah, interesting. Anyway, where did you, uh, where did your fox friend get off to? I was just wondering what? about that. I am going to take a look around the clearing. Is there any sign of Quithup at all? Uh, probably a lot of broken branches and like pushed aside bushes. <laughs> How's it? <laughs> How did we miss him leaving? <laughs> hey, hey, quip up! You might have snuck away under the great clamor of the birds. Hello? 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 Where, where are you? I'm on top of a tree! Oh. What? Which one? Why? <laughs> I was trying to catch a bird! Do you see anything interesting on the horizon? Everything. That's was it a burrowing bird? <laughs> Did you catch it? I have it right here. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> you want some? Oh no 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 no! no. Don't eat don't no, eat the bird! No. Don't eat the bird! No 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 no! Unless no, no, you're no, already no, eating no, the bird fox. and then finish it off. <laughs> Isn't it kind of in character for a fox to eat a bird? Eat the bird! No one cares. <laughs> don't eat the don't eat no 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 don't eat the bird. Well, maybe he's hungry. Who are we to tell him not to eat a bird? I'm not going to eat a bird, but he can eat a bird. I don't want him to eat the bird, though. It's it's probably a nice bird. Quith, please put the... Could you put the bird it's, down? If it, it's there a burrowing bird, it's not a nice bird. Us. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to come one down bird going, now. What difference is it going to make? Okay, you do that. <laughs> come, on, come on down. I clamber down the tree. I still have the bird in hand. Oh. <laughs> Oh, you brought okay. it down here. Oh, oh, you heard it. Hold okay, on. Okay, you're bringing it right up to us. I'm okay. Yeah. Uh. Oh, uh, bring it, it over here. Angry. It's, it's oh, okay. Her. Okay. Uh, Brimtail kind of reaches out for the bird. No. <laughs> oh, you heard oh. it though. Come on. No, I didn't. <laughs> the bird is like, yeah. <laughs> is anybody I'm just gonna hungry? Nap while you all do this. <laughs> yeah. Let me help you out with that. Come on, Quithum, yeah. give me the bird. Here, I'll um, I'll I'll give you something else in exchange. Broomtail reaches back into her oh, bag. Oh, like what? Um, how about bird. whatever's in this mysterious bag? A mystery bag? It's a mystery bag. Oh, <laughs> and I'll even guarantee that it's edible. Really? Really. Oh, a mystery breakfast bag. <laughs> <laughs> Broomtail nods, smiling. Okay. You can have the bird I caught. <laughs> Just don't eat it all at once, okay? Yeah. <laughs> Liana shudders in the background. <laughs> Broomtail makes the exchange, trading the blue-tailed crow for the um for the mystery <laughs> bag. It does have like um it does have like a weird burrowing beak to it. Like <laughs> drill shape. It's yeah, like, like it's, it's got shaped a, like a shovel. Yeah, no, it's got a <laughs> shovel shaped beak. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <sad. laughs> oh, man. I turn around and kind of obscure myself with my tail and just open the bag immediately. Okay, it's yeah, it's a um, it's a food stuff from a faraway land. I believe they call this a uh, bagel, 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 bag full of bagels, <laughs> bagel. You just eating it? Uh huh. <laughs> it's actually delicious. I'm I'm not gonna do fully for that. That's gross. <laughs> Regardless. Regardless. I'm glad that you had to, like it's funny you had to think about it. <laughs> well, I was like stuffing my mouth with my shirt. Like here, I'll do this. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Broomtail no. walks over to uh, Jasmine with the um, <laughs> the shovel beaked bird. Do you, do you have Do you have a name for this guy? Um, he's probably a little hurt. What? So, wait, like, a name for the species? Uh, the ge the genus was it? Oh, uh, those are. Uh... Lean into chat. <laughs> chat. Yeah. <laughs> Chat name What's is bird. Chat name the bird. Name the bird species. Does it? Yeah, it doesn't need a nickname. That's how you get attached. We're gonna let it go. Far away. <laughs> no one can eat it. <laughs> Lovely. 
Is this, I think this is Broomtail Stops Quith Up From Eating Things campaign. Yeah, it's looking like that. <laughs> We've got Bagel Bird. Birdro. Oh. Um, his name is Batman? That's a nickname. That's how you get attached. <laughs> Mistake number one. Shovelware Sparrow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, mocking, mocking Spade, I like. Ooh, Ooh that's so Ooh, yeah. good. I like that a yeah. lot. That's a mocking spade. It looks like a spade, so that's probably how it got its name. Aw. Hey, little shovel bird, you'll, you'll get better soon. Broomtail kind of, like, puts it down on the ground. It's still freaking furious. And she's going to, uh, like, <laughs> attempt to tie something around its slightly damaged wing. What? Are we going to get probably breakfast? Probably going to get pecked. Or... or maybe not pecked, since it has a shovel for a... Birds are weird. <laughs> <laughs> yes. She kind of like, I, uh, pu she puts it up on her head. Oh, it's sticking in my hair. <laughs> I think it's I trying watch to it kill intently. me. I watch it intently. Bagel bag stuck on one of my ears. I use one of those to dig my den. <laughs> that's that's As a nice. tool? A yeah, yeah, den? That's, you that's live in a den? Yeah. No, it's not horrifying. The fact that you used a bird to dig a hole? I don't really feel in? good about that. Don't you want to live in a house? I can't you afford a house. Let's just call you resourceful and be done with it, yeah? <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, okay. you're very resourceful, Quitha. Yes. <laughs> Broomtail kind of ruffles <laughs> your hair. The bird continues just, like, digging in hers. The bagel oh, bag is stuck. That's so cute. You're uh, you're bleeding. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> well, that 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 might just be old blood. It's it's probably not a problem. <laughs> like uh, her hair is you... completely tousled at this point. Right. Do you want something for that? I'll I'll give you something later. Just once the bird is done pecking you and getting its gross. No. Hmm. Anybody hungry for breakfast? Let's move yes! on. <laughs> yeah, I could do with some breakfast that is not bird-based. Are you going to eat here or elsewhere? Let's go ahead and have a quick meal here. No, let's see if we can get Arya to make more fish. <laughs> oh, you know what? That's actually a great idea. Yeah, because if we do it here, it'll be bird-based. I know it. <laughs> bird-based is good. Hey, how about Maybe next time? Maybe for you, Quithup. Yeah. Okay, well. Let's head down and see Arya. You travel into town. Please. Jasmine is looking for stories along the way, but uh, nothing interesting. Hmm. Oh, are you... Do you ask for stories? No. Okay. <laughs> you're looking, you're looking <laughs> I'm looking like. for it. Yeah, stories, interesting things to happen, but it's just a walk. Yeah, so. you just walk over. You're looking for interesting things to happen. You just shake your head like not a thing as this shovel <laughs> bird continues to dig in <laughs> your friend's hair. <laughs> Something tells me that's going to be the norm. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so I think we just uh, walk on over to the restaurant. Yep. Yeah. Uh, burnt broom? The burnt broom. I forgot we burnt called broom. it that. That's so good. Right. Hey, Aryark, are you here? There's no, uh, there's no call from inside. Your voice kind of bounces off the empty walls. Hello, Hello? fish! Are you here? <laughs> <laughs> Your voice bounces off the empty walls, finding no hmm. fish. I'm gonna go poke my head back into the kitchen. Aryark? Uh-oh. Hello? Hello? Yeah, no, Do there's... I see any cooking supplies back here? Yes, indeed you do. She left it unlocked. Well... Ariark's not here, but, but it's I not bet I could cook some fish for you. Yes. Are there fish here? Uh, are we going to eat for fish? Just then, you hear a you hear like a scrambling sound, followed by an occasional bark. Something slamming into the back door and dragging its way inside. Tangled in a dozen <laughs> fish nets, an old dog <laughs> drags up a bunch of fish from the nearby waters. He careens <laughs> into the center of the room and flops over onto his back, displaying his belly for all to see. There's like flopping fish and nets all around him. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, yes, breakfast is here. <laughs> I immediately pet the dog. Immediately. 
immediately. Felix. The <laughs> dog gets dog bucks. <laughs> the dog gets dog bucks. Yep. <laughs> oh my god. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you. <laughs> well, are you? Oh, that makes sense. You used to work in a noodle shop. I I, I bet you'd be a great cook, actually. Yeah, my mom used to say things about how I was a despicable culinarian, but I think those are just words. <laughs> those are certainly words. Those are words. And besides, I can eat my own food, and that's all that matters, right? Yes. Yeah. Uh, I can eat your food. Could you like some help? Sure, why not? Everyone's yeah. food. <laughs> we'll make a lot of food for everyone. There's so many fish. Let's all make breakfast together. Yeah, let's, let's make a lot of fish so these don't rot on the floor. I don't know how to cook, but I can dance so that you cook better. Okay. Okay. Sure. Yeah, do a breakfast dance. Stay away from the stove, though. <laughs> oh, and yeah. that rack of knives. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and you know what? The spice rack, too, probably. Oh, oh, oh. I can, I can go get something from my cart to help with this. Uh, Bruntail disappears. The horrible cawing of her bird also vanishing as well. <laughs> <laughs> It's just like this thing is furious and just constantly <laughs> digging on her head. <laughs> okay. Um uh a few minutes pass uh, as Broomtail's gone. What are you, what are you going to use in this fish dish? Well, we got I got all sorts of herbs. See, I was just planning on like a nice like pan fried like some pan fried fillets or something, you know, if that sounds good to everyone. Oh, yeah. I can I want... help season it, I guess. I'll see what I've got. Oh, yeah. I don't, I'm not very good with seasoning, so you should probably oversee that. I'm going to start cleaning these fish. I take out a small brush. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> you never brush a fish before? Yeah, come on, boss. Keep going. Keep going. No, no, no. I, I start. I actually, I start using the brush to descale the fish, and then actually pull the knife out and properly clean it. <laughs> <laughs> a few minutes later, Broomtail charges back in, carrying a large purple-bound book. Here you go. Here's my mostly unfinished cookbook. <laughs> you cook? Who needs a Who needs a cookbook? I worked in a restaurant. <laughs> Did you write this? Nope. I found it. <laughs> oh. oh well, actually, that makes it interesting. <laughs> Take it all back. <laughs> she, Wait she... a minute, that was incredibly rude. I'm yeah, sorry, no, she Bruntail. appears hurt for like point <laughs> five of a second, but realizes you probably didn't oh mean my, it that oh way. Oh my god, I wasn't. I wasn't even. I wasn't even thinking about what I said. I'm sorry, Brimtail. <laughs> oh, it's, it's 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 okay. Just uh, yeah. Why don't you check it out? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh wow. This yeah. just has a lot of kind of blank spaces where I guess ingredients were supposed to go some of the time. You gain uh, another I artifact. <laughs> I squeeze oh, between nice. everybody and look uh, at what they're looking at. What's okay. it say? Okay, so the mostly unfinished cookbook. <laughs> the mostly unfinished cookbook adds cooking mechanics to the game. <gasps> oh no! Yes! Yeah, no, this is very important. <laughs> this is what I've been waiting for! Yeah, sorry, you're still on the tutorial section. Uh, <laughs> no! No, uh, the mostly unfinished cookbook lets you, uh... It, it, you know how I changed camping up? Cooking has changed up in a similar way. However, the way it, it exists. Yeah, well, the way it works is as you start to like, as you start to figure out recipes and put ingredients together, you get the ability to reproduce them. Now, food as a whole is a bigger mechanic than what I want to get into right now. There are two okay. small details about it that um like that I think are kind of cute. Uh, one thing is, um, since you guys haven't rolled condition for today, and I wanted you guys to eat breakfast before you oh, rolled condition, right. and you walked into my masterfully laid GM plans. <laughs> um, but, uh, yeah. Uh, basically what cooking does, especially when you're eating a good breakfast, is it gives you additional chances to re-roll your, uh, condition checks at the start of the day. You basically <laughs> do better if you're going on a full stomach, obviously, especially a well-cooked meal. Now... Furthermore, the game did have a base modifier for delicious food. The way that works is a little bit different now. Now your food's graded on a scale, pretty much, with increasing mm -hmm. bonuses based on how well you did. Every time you make a dish, it's recorded in the mostly unfinished cookbook. And so long as you can functionally no longer fail making the dish, you can only make it better from that point onwards by improving on it. Cool. Um, but yeah, so like... First things first, the way that this works is you need to choose the ingredients you're adding to it and you need to provide the dish with a name and then we can take it from there. Oh boy. 
Um, furthermore, uh, this is a small detail, but uh, later you're going to have a mechanic added to your um, character sheet called Hometowns, where you'll add a hometown that your character grew up in. And food from your hometown, as a rule, is always considered maximum delicious. That's just how it works. Mm. Uh-oh. <laughs> well, uh... So let's. So this is. Um, these are salt saltwater fish, right? Yes. So shall we say it's like a red snapper or something? I do like the sound of that. I like. Do you, I like? I like giving the the fish new names. You know. Yeah, actually, that's a that's a good point. How about? Uh, hey, hey, chat. What do you think is a good name for the type of fish we're making? Actually, hold on. I want to give no. me a give me a check beforehand. I want okay. you guys um... to give me a. Who's the most likely to know about fish here? Like, um, as, um, uh, like... The depends on what you mean. Like, the... <laughs> <laughs> like, ultimately, this question is, uh, is it Jasmine who would know about what type of fish this is? Like, where it, uh, hails from? Um... If it's, like, a basic fish, it's probably identify it. Okay, then um... Jasmine, give me an intellect yeah, plus Jasmine, intellect but... check. Okay. Chat, get ready for these sweet macros. Yeah. Oh, get ready. <laughs> I mean, there's already a spoiler in the upper right what it looks like, but that's that's fine. And I just got to click this thing four times. Oop. That Not sure is good. a six. Uh, that's okay, though. Um, <laughs> if, like, a six is an exactly average roll for a normal character, so that, that doesn't. Like, crossing the dangerous grasslands required a six. If you'd remember, in most in <laughs> most games, not. a six would be very bad. But um, Ryutama, <laughs> when your dice f size can get as low as four, it's not that bad. Um, no, uh, <laughs> these uh, the fish that are caught around Wayward actually are a very specific type. They're they're an ancient fish. They are um, they're named after a former age. It's it's not a it's not the kindest name in the world. But these are the blood soaked fight fish. They are. Uh, oh my God! <laughs> they are a. Uh, they are a red school of fish that uh, circles the ruins of a great underground um, aquapolis, uh, a set of ruins that uh, adventurers and wanderers alike explore, known as Tournament City. Um, <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> these fish are the. Do most... they have serrated fins? Because I think they could use them. <laughs> no. <laughs> No, no, no. They're not. They're not quite that bad. But due to their relationship with such a place, and due to their blood red color, they are most closely related with the last stage. So yeah, no. Hmm. These are, these are fight fish, and they're the most common thing on the northern coast. Cool. Well, yeah, that's a fight fish. You can tell because it's so intimidating. <laughs> the fish menaces you. <laughs> I was wondering if that was normal for fish or not. <laughs> for fight fish? They're pretty tasty, though. If you say so. <laughs> okay. You got them all cleaned up and uh, deboned. Yeah, I'll get back to clean. I'll get, I'll get back to taking the oh. bones out of this fish, man. Brushing. Okay. So your ingredients include one fight fish. Um, what else are you going to put in the dish? This! <laughs> I just dump some leaves onto the ground. <laughs> okay. Dump right. some what? Leaves. leaves. Okay. Uh, I'd like, like to... I give them a sniff. Are they aromatic at all? Yes. Uh, can I use Sniffer, one of my skills, oh. to uh, have found, like, tasty leaves? Oh, that tech. Sounds like herb gathering to me. Yeah, uh, hmm. Stop stepping on my toes. They, guys... they don't necessarily have to be, like, edible, but... <laughs> they smell mm, nice. Okay. Do they smell nice? <laughs> okay, you bring the stuff. I'll yeah. check it yeah, to yeah, see yeah. if it's poison. That's like perfect. That. Uh, yeah. No. Um. Give me a. Ooh. Give Dex me a. Dex plus spirit for sniffer. Yeah. Dex plus spirit for sniffer. Dex cool. Spirit. I get. Ooh, come on. Got what they smell got? really nice. They make my tongue kind of numb. <laughs> Let's see what you got. Okay. Uh, yeah, no, you immediately... <laughs> okay, let me... Let me grab my Ryutama book. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. Okay, what I did like you these. Get? I eat them when I have an upset stomach, and it makes me feel better. <laughs> really? 
I have never seen a leaf like that before. Yeah, neither have I. They grow in ditches. <laughs> you don't you don't say. I'm yeah, gonna make like smell. small notes of all of this. Oh yeah, those smell those smell interesting actually. It smells like the sensation of numb. <laughs> <laughs> it smells kinda like an antiseptic. Huh. Yeah. Okay. You've loaded me uh, puke. You've <laughs> Um, man, uh, okay, if it makes you puke, I gotta change what it is. Oh, I was no. going for the oh, dog no. that eats grass thing. Yeah, yeah, I thought it so. just eats so many. Okay. Oh, actually, Barris is going to pop up from the floor, wagging his tail, rub himself against Quitham, and go, yeah, I do that too. Yeah, <laughs> really I start munching on it with Aunt Barris. <laughs> oh my Wait, god. Don't eat it now. Oh, it's so good. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's not use that. Okay, I'll just eat it. Is that the last one? Is that I the ate only it one? All. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'll find more. There is trust. That's fine. <laughs> okay. Okay, so there are some options in the book for this to be, but uh, <laughs> I'm almost tempted. I don't to... think he ate it all. Also, we should add some of this in. <laughs> Yeah, uh, it could either be demon liqueur, <laughs> which is mildly uh -huh. poisonous, uh, uh -huh. daybreak crimson flower, which is uh, my OC. It, it removes <laughs> it's it removes physical status ailments, which makes sense. However, oh. it also contains a powerful narcotic, so it must be taken. Uh, it must be taken oh, with oh, intense oh, oh, care. Oh, 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 that one. Okay. <laughs> oh yes, my god. Cool. Uh, yeah. <laughs> no. What is it called? Daybreak, Daybreak Crimson, Crimson Flower or something. Wow. Okay. Oh, um. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's Daybreak Crimson Flower. And Jasmine, you immediately recognize it as very dangerous. Yeah. I have like a handful in my mouth. <laughs> what? No, no, no. Oh, quit that. Take those out. Take those out. What? Put them down oh, carefully. No, why is your mouth foaming? Oh, Don't... that's really worrying. Ooh. Did did the thorns get you at all? Yeah, I, I just chew around them and pull them out when I eat it, though. Quith up, you're drooling really badly. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> all right, yeah. all right, it's fine. Let me... Jasmine begins rootling around her pack. Kind of is nervous. Golden Sky stories, by the way. <laughs> what was that? I just <laughs> lost Golden Sky stories, by the way. Yeah. <laughs> I'm I'm actually shocked that this is just in Ryutama, but yes. Me too, actually. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's okay. a very dangerous plant. Um, yes. I'm gonna scavenge around the kitchen for any other ingredients, <laughs> what's, like fresh. What's Jasmine doing? Freshest vegetables. Uh, or I'm I'm finding some uh some medicine to help you. Oh, perfect. That's that's ideal. Make us unlose Ooh. Golden Sky stories. Look for some tasty <laughs> herbs or spices too. <laughs> All right, I'm, I'm going, going to scavenge the kitchen. I, I, I don't hear Leota at all because I'm yeah. sweating. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Dangerous situation. Okay. Immediately. Okay, Quithip, this is going to be pretty gross, and it's well, better than overdosing on plants, though. Uh, but don't take much of this because you might overdose on this. Okay. I'm going to use... Healing. Or first aid, honestly. First aid, yeah. yeah. In plus oh, they're spirit. both the same stat. <laughs> All my stuff is in plus spirit. It's perfect. Nice. <clears throat> you want me to dance? Nope. Hold very <laughs> still. Don't agitate your blood. Okay. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, no. Uh, <laughs> while we don't need to get into Very the nice. specifics of it, uh, Jasmine is able to immediately treat the fox. <laughs> oh, I feel okay. better now. Yeah, you'll still feel a little, uh, numb in, in probably your body <laughs> for yeah. a bit. <laughs> but, um, you should be okay. If you start seeing dots, let me know. Dots? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Spots in your vision, uh, ringing in your ears, uh, blood out the nose. Just no. Just let me know. I'll take care of you. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Don't need any more of those. Oh. Yeah. 
please. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, now that we've got, yeah, no, no, now that we got into immediate trouble while cooking breakfast. breakfast um, <laughs> what other ingredients are you adding? It depends. I'm looking through the kitchen to see if there's anything tasty looking in here. Okay, yeah, give me a roll for scavenging. Um, there it is. Oh yeah, you're... can I just have stuff? Yeah, absolutely. Just a few things. All right. Yeah, that would. I think that would make sense, especially for Jasmine. Oh yeah, absolutely. Um. Oh yeah. No. Friggin' yeah. ten in the. Okay. Yeah, you reach through <laughs> the kitchen. Uh, you scrumble through the kitchen real quick and uh, actually discover. Uh, uh, what do you want to find? A spice rack. Um. I'm. I think I'm going to depend on jasmine for most of the Ooh. spices i'm looking for like anything that can be prepared as a side like some potatoes or some other vegetables or something bugs? Just... Ooh, i've got no. something um no, well maybe not bugs. maybe bugs but maybe maybe something other than bugs if i find some bugs i can make you some bugs you bugs uh are best raw. yeah you discover okay what was the name of that perfect um alcohol you guys made in uh wheat wine wheat wine yeah uh, hmm. you find, yeah, you find a little bottle tucked aside of the dream wheat wine. Um, a little bit of excess. We can throw this into the pan with the fish. This will be great. There you go. Hell yeah. I have found in my pack some lemon pepper. Okay. And a bit of basil. Oh, okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna... Sprinkle some flakes of the uh, dried lemon pepper in there and have it uh, cook with the basil on it. Excellent. Mm -hmm. So and then it gets that flavor in there. Okay, Ooh, nice. I'm going to need two rolls from you guys. I'm going to need one from Jackson and one from Matt. Now, these rolls are important. You guys get to choose mm -hmm. what the stats, uh, what the stat, what stats are used for this dish. But they will permanently be the stats associated with cooking this dish. So mm. pick something and relevant. Are these um, whatever what your strongest is good, Jackson? I have sixes across the board. Okay, let's use intelligence. And plus in cool. Uh, or like you've got to choose int and two spirit, stats, maybe, yeah. or int and dex. And it and... is two people cooking it, correct? Yes. Yeah, I think, I think, um, but I think the Quithip is dancing to make it even better. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. If, if we want me to still do that, I, I absolutely do that. Okay. Oh, wait, but okay. are you supposed to not agitate your blood? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I think Quithip should sit down for a bit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay. I just, I just lay down on my face. Okay. Uh, let me know if everything hurts. Well, It'd be great if you could dance when we make lunch, though. No, so I intelligence we'll and what back. are we going with? Um, uh, it depends. What are your stats? Uh, not dex. Okay, uh, int and spirit then. Yeah. Cool. You Excellent. you can go first. I'll roll second. Uh, is it <clears throat> two int and spirit rolls then? Okay. Well, Sounds can good to me. can Matt or, use different oh, stats? Can we, can Absolutely. Or... Oh, okay, cool. I'll do. Um, I will do. Strength and Dex in that case. Ooh, so it's a oh, that encompasses yeah. all the stats. Perfect. Uh huh. Oh my God, Jackson. Well this done. This is gonna be good. Jasmine, you're a cooking champion. Um. Oh, uh. You just me... gotta know what. Uh, it's not good. great, but that'll do. Hold on. <laughs> um, let me double check <clears throat> something. I I'm pretty sure Brimtail can assist. Ah, you guys are fine. You're you're fine with cooking. No reason to use her abilities. Um. I distract yeah, Broomtail. I, I think that, like, Liana's <laughs> going to go into this expecting to be the main chef for the dish, but she ends up kind of, like, playing assistant to, uh, to Jasmine in the end. Okay, yeah, you... Wow, you cook this thing... Hmm. You cook this dish better than you could have ever expected. Uh, you pull out the fish, normally a ruddy red, um, and... It, when you pull it back, it suddenly dyed a rainbow color. The alcohol seems to have resounded uh, spectacularly with its scales. Uh, whatever chemical process is happening here is positively wondrous. Wow, I've got to write about this. I'm that going to grab amazing. The, What's chemical? I'm going to grab Ari Ark's journal and just jot stuff down about this. 
Well done, Leota. I think we did a pretty good job. Smells yeah, really I think you ended up doing most of it, actually. Jasmine, you have you have a real gift here. No, oh, I just know what leaves taste good. And yeah, which leaves are poison. That's that's a gift. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna need a name for this dish. Hmm. Um I need to also like give you a description of it. Like a more clear description of it. Uh a smell yeah, hangs let's in, eat it. a smell uh, hangs fried, in the air. Fried fight fish fillet. Sorry. Go yeah, on. A smell hangs in the air that's like you'd expect it to be fishy, but it almost it it smells like more weedy than mm. anything else. Like um mm. like it it smells like uh, plants and herbs. The any scent of the fish is simply masked by it. A beautiful aroma that's a little acrid to the nose surrounds the fish, um, probably stemming from the wheat wine. However, both the looks and the smell are just just positively <clears throat> gorgeous. As you uh, take the first bite, uh, the outside of the fish is covered with a slight flaky crust. Um, biting into it, contained within is an almost perfect explosive flavor. It pops against your tongue, melting away almost immediately. The outside has been covered in a, a thin crust as a result of you um, uh, making it with the wheat wine that was also somehow made with mushrooms in it. Uh, a chromatic <laughs> mushroom, as it were, um, that likely brought out its color. But the inside, that is pure fight fish flavor. It's It's a classic, like... As far as fish go, it is a meaty one. It is the beef of the sea. And it's absorbed, <laughs> it has absorbed all the flavor of what's along the outside. Jay, I think you just named wow. the dish. The beef. No, like, like <laughs> the fish is already the, the beef of the sea. This is like what you guys oh, okay, prepared okay. here is like a fine steak. Wow. I'm so hungry now. <laughs> yeah, fucking welcome to Ryutama where I describe every last one oh. of your meals. <laughs> Uh, okay, time to quit the stream and go get food. Yeah. <laughs> right. Bye, everyone. So, yeah, this dish needs a name. Chat can name it or you guys can name it. But from now on, whenever you try to do this in the future, I should read out your mm -hmm. recipe. It requires wheat wine, fight fish, lemon pepper, and basil, an int roll, a spirit, uh, an int plus spirit roll, and a strength plus dex roll. And currently, you've made it with a combined 20. So, in order to reach this level of quality again, you need to match a 20, which is absurdly difficult. Let alone oh, wow. the bonuses you got for using a high-quality wheat wine. The quality of this dish is actually off the charts. So what you're saying is we're never gonna make it this good again. You're probably not gonna make this dish as good again, no. Uh, but you can always make other dishes. Okay. My favorite suggestion so far is Heaven's Gate Filet. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> How about, okay, Heaven's Filet. <laughs> oh my god. Nice, nice, Jackson. <laughs> Gotta push that brand. <laughs> wow. Uh, you feel some drool on your shoulder. Who does? You both, both of, of you. us. Yeah, that's what I <laughs> oh yeah, we got, we got a quiff up and a dog. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that smells so good. Well, dig in. Some? Yes! Yeah, go right ahead. Uh, uh, I want to be polite, though. You should have your... You, you should eat first. We're eating together. Come on. Everyone. Oh, I already no. had a bagel. I don't... If I start eating now, I'll eat all of it. Quit up. I can hear your... I can hear your stomach growling. Come on. Well, that might... That might be the thistle, but... <laughs> <laughs> but no, just eat slowly, take it easy, your stomach's <laughs> recovering. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh my god. Well, that was slower than I expected. <laughs> this, this so are we going are we going with Heaven's Fillet? Because I like that. Heaven's, yeah, heaven's Fillet. Heaven's Fillet. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Jay, you've pushed enough bad names in our lifetime. Yeah, that's true. Okay, so yeah, you fill in on the mostly unfinished, uh, God, recipe book, Heaven's Filet. <laughs> okay. Um, oh, you guys actually seem pretty, pretty adept with that. Um, uh, if you want, like, I could, oh, I, I might have a, hmm, I might have an ancient artifact that could maybe help you with similar things in the future uh broomtail kind of like yes 
Star yes, please, Star Eyes. <laughs> I'm just sitting on the floor wow. licking the pan. <laughs> he is chock full of artifacts. Sorry, guys, this is what... This is... I To spoil something minor, this game has a semi-achievement-based system, uh, and when you bypass oh. a uh, cooking check to a certain degree, you trigger something. Um, oh, I didn't okay. expect it on the very first one, but yes. <laughs> Way to go. Uh, no, uh, yeah, we crushed it. Broomtail runs back in, carrying a um, carrying an ancient cooking knife. It's it has a sort of black oh. blade to it. Uh, oh. It looks <laughs> it radiate positively radiates culinary power. Is that a seasoned <laughs> knife? I never even knew you could do that. Yeah, it's uh, it's 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 a really ancient knife. I found I found uh, you don't you probably don't want to know where I found it. It it was uh, found in a very old place. Um, if if you it's guys so want clean. it, I can, yeah, I could probably place. give it to you for a certain number of dream dollars. Oh, I have dream what, dollars. What is it? Is it just a really nice knife? It's it's like this. She holds oh. it up for a split second. Uh. Can somebody, like, put something down for me to chop up? I put down the pan. Nope, not that. <laughs> Here, uh, how about on this fish? Uh, yeah, presented with another fight fish. Broomtail immediately chops it to bits, quickly uh, pan fries it, and produces the classic beef of the sea, the traditional yeah. dish for, uh, for this. Can I eat that was again? A... Could... Wait, can you do that normally, or was that the knife? Um, it's something I learned from the knife, actually. She kind of uh, puts the knife down and, like, uh, returns it to her pack. Now, what this knife does is, it's a... When acquired, it'll give you access, actually, to, once again, another new mechanic. If you so choose, by purchasing this from... Yeah, I, I hear the smacking sounds in the background. <laughs> um... <laughs> Uh, yeah, by purchasing this item, you can actually class change, which is a, a minor, Ooh. major thing I added to the game system. Um, class changing to the chef class. Now, Ooh. chefs have a huge bonus when it comes to cooking, and they're very able in this regard. By cooking something so spectacularly right off the bat, you spark Broomtail's memory, reminding her that she had such an artifact. Huh. Wow. Well. Well, we've got to we've got to go for the mechanics. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, no we got to. You got to yeah, gotta. like if you if you so choose to Now, the deal with class changing is something I'll explain later, but you might as well unlock the class. I'm not going to do it. Yeah, no. Yeah. You got to get that 100% completion. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what um how how expensive is it? 30 dream bucks. Oh, that's a lot. I checked my how dream wallet cuz I don't know how many I have. I don't know how many I have either. <laughs> I kept notes on how many Oops, you guys have. It's fine. Oh, um, thank God. Oh, cool. I don't think we I have too many. To, I forgot to bring my notes. Uh, yeah, on. we can't have. I don't, I don't think we have 30. Yeah, no, your we'll group grand. Like, though. I've been grand totaling your groups. You have eight right now. Okay. Yeah. That's a little out of our price range, I think. But Here, you can have my yeah. dream. My dreams. <laughs> I hand yeah. over. Oh, actually, Wait, are these Foss, like? I, I forgot. Take Foss, Take some dream dollars for the like eating grass thing. I forgot that oh. we could hand those. <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> that yeah, was true. I forgot about. I forgot we hand those out. It's it's me too. Everybody gets two dream dollars from me retrospectively. Okay. Hooray! <laughs> Everyone gets thirty dream dollars. <laughs> yeah, thirty dream dollars. Yeah, you gotta um, learn this thing okay. fair and square. Yeah. I'll bump, well, these, like, I'll bump it. You... I'm gonna bump it up to fifteen for the last scene. And I think that's okay. fair. Do we, uh, are these like physical things that we have? Oh, or... yeah. Uh, they just appear. Yeah, no, um, uh, this is an item that appears technically in universe in, uh, Leota's dream wallet. Oh, right. She has a dream. Oh, okay. Gosh. Never mind. Yeah. I was going to like hand them my dollars. <laughs> no. No, no. Canonically, they appear okay. in her dream wallet, but yeah. Yeah. Gotcha. Well, if you, I mean, you're keep it, you've kept it with you, so maybe later we'll buy it. Yep. Anytime. Oh, cool. Great. Oh man, Great. and I haven't yeah. even t technically opened my shop for business yet. This is this is astounding, guys. Oh, can I have some of that, by the way? Of course. Oh. There's pl there's plenty for everyone. Oh, um. <laughs> there's plenty for everyone. <laughs> It's I'm okay. sorry. It's okay. I'll eat, this is what I'll eat. I was afraid of. <laughs> I'll eat. I'll eat my own fish. It's okay. Your own fish. 
She did pre- prepare her own beef of the sea. Oh no. <laughs> okay. So. Sorry about that. I didn't. I should have expected. <laughs> <laughs> so, you, uh, after consuming this fish, I'm going to have you guys roll your condition check for the day. Cool, cool. Uh, condition normally is. I'm like 99% sure it is. It should say it on your character Strength sheet. Strength plus spirit. Strength plus spirit. Darn straight. Okay. Now, after consuming a truly delicious meal, uh, you guys get many oh. rerolls for this, if you so wish. Okay. So Yeah, I want another one. Yeah, go again. Uh, let's do them one at a time, actually. Just, okay. to, okay. just to keep things um, straight. Uh, Leota. Jackson, go ahead and do yours. Oh, okay. Yeah, you, you rolled first, so you get to roll again. You Jesus. get to roll again. Do I get one, do I get one more? Thank Continue God. rolling. I'm... I'll take that one. That's You'll fine. You'll choose to take this one? Okay, perfect. <laughs> yes, I think uh, so. Jasmine, I should point out that a five-star meal gives you five re-rolls in addition to oh. other bonuses. Oh. Do we get, I just uh, don't know if I'm going to get over a ten. Equal to how many stars it is? Could be. <laughs> now, furthermore, um, Leota, uh, by uh, rolling a ten or higher, you're in tip-top shape today. Hell yes. Which means you get to increase the dice size of one of your abilities by one. Ooh, okay. Let's do it for... Is this a five-star meal we have? This is indeed mm-hmm. a five-star meal. I'm a five-star meal. Um... <laughs> I am a five-star meal. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, in, I'll, in, I'll uh, increase my dex, I guess. Nice. <clears throat> so I, I just, that's by one dice size? Yes. <laughs> Jasmine, what the fuck? <laughs> I'll, I'll take the seven. Yeah, the seven is fine. <laughs> what the hell was that? My pen leaked. I need to go wash my hands. Be right back. <laughs> and uh, quiff up, if you would. Okay. That is a nine. Pretty good. Strength plus spirit. Oof. (laughs) Okay, so you're still sticking with the nine for now. So far. What? Did I do that wrong? No. No, you got nine again. Another nine. Let's see if you can break ten. (laughs) Well, you rolled a d8 that last one. Oh yeah. Okay. Wait. It's it's fine. But it doesn't matter. You still How did it roll a d8? No, <laughs> it's it's fine. You're overthinking it. Okay. If you say so. You did oh, it in I reverse see. order. Yeah. I see. Or did you? <laughs> How many? Do I get one more reroll? You get a grand total of six rolls with a five star meal. I haven't six. Done yeah. Oh. You get five entire rerolls. Oh, so I you still get your attached. initial roll and then five additional ones. What am I on now? <laughs> You're supposed to be keeping track. One, two, one, three, two, three, four, four five. five. You this get is one my more. last roll. Yep. Sorry, nine! it looks like you don't beat it. You start with a nine. Still, I've got one more. more. All right. Nope. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so we've got 10, 9, and 7. Wait a that's, second. That's pretty good. This isn't... Oh, no, it is correct. Dark. Okay, Dark. perfect. I'm back. What's happening? Uh, everybody tried and failed to break 10. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, so I, I have a question. If you choose to re-roll something like this, can you, like, not fall back on a previous roll? You Do you can. have to take the newer one? Oh, no. Oh, this I should is... just keep rolling then. What am I even doing? You're you're fine. Just take the ten. It's okay, dude. I'm gonna crush it as hard as I can. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Eleven. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. The- One more. <laughs> wow. Okay, I'll take the eleven. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Wow. Okay, so we got eleven, nine, and seven. Those are those are real good condition checks for the day. Okay, so yeah, you finish you finish your meal and feel positively astounding, except for Jasmine, who feels just kind of average, despite yeah. eating yeah. great. Do you usually eat fish, Jasmine? <laughs> I, I do. Sometimes. When I, you want when me I have to show them. you how to eat fish better? Uh, that's okay. I don't, I don't think, think my think stomach can handle it that fast. <laughs> I don't think anyone can eat quite like you can, Quithup. <laughs> Uh, I beam proudly at that. 
<laughs> I, I don't press it and let the fox take the compliment. <laughs> <laughs> Quote unquote compliment. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, anyway, you guys, we've got a we've got a whole day ahead of ourselves. What do you what do you want to do? We need to find Ariark. She knows oh. things to do. I just want to travel. Yeah, oh, well, great! We, I don't know if we should just leave. We haven't said goodbye or that we're leaving. I mean, oh, she if knows we what we're leave, doing. I can leave a note. Ooh, ooh, yeah, do you just... that's a great uh, wait. You can you? <laughs> uh, I'm just getting my hand dirty and put it on the front door. The front door now has oh. just a muddy handprint on it. Okay, well, we'll okay. I'll leave okay. a note, another note as well, maybe. Yeah, because that she might find that paper. threatening. <laughs> scrolling, uh, Ariark, we've headed out to look for stories. Be back soon. Excellent. Um, oh, I forgot to add could... something. Oh, okay. What did you forget to add? Another handprint. Oh, yeah. there it is. I'm going to put thank you on it. Oh, yeah, good it. idea. <laughs> also, as uh, as you all walk outside, you notice Ferris lying on his back, staring at the sun and trying to dig a hole in the sky. <laughs> Box. Box, Box yeah. Thanks. Yeah. Oh, my God, always. <laughs> oh, my God, yeah, you walk outside and see Ferris. Hey, hey there, little guy. Do you want to come along with us? Busy. <laughs> <laughs> he Dog box. Serious. <laughs> okay, as a, um, yeah. <laughs> From down the road, you see someone traveling towards you with a huge stack of boxes towering Ooh. up high. Oh no, they're really big. <laughs> What do what do their legs look like? Yeah, no, straining beneath it, you can clearly <laughs> do, see. I guess not. Do I recognize those gams. Yeah, you recognize Ariark dragging a gigantic mountain of just things towards you. Oh, oh I'll go help! Wow, she is really strong. She kind of really? like turns, seeing you guys, side eyes you for a second. Oh, hey guys, how's it going? I'm running hey. towards her. Oh, we were boy. wondering where you were. Look out! <laughs> uh, <laughs> are you gonna like? dive on her and like comically make everything fall to the ground no i'm not i'm not mean quithub's dumb but not that dumb <laughs> that's like that is like dog dumb though he has like basic fox understanding dumb. of <laughs> the empirical nature of the world okay 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 of gravity okay yeah cause and effect can i help can i help uh yeah sure you can take these three off the top she hands you the three they're incredibly heavy oh i can do I'm it just... <laughs> Uh, just here. record this feat of strength real fast. This is incredible. <laughs> yeah. Let me, uh... With it, are you okay? And don't quit, don't agitate your blood. Admirably, too. <laughs> well, I'm no, glad you... Me... How'd you I guys enjoy your stay last night? Was the observatory to your liking? Yes! <laughs> it's wonderful! It's got a bit of a, right. of a mocking spade problem, but that's easily fixed. <laughs> I like it. I like yeah, it. There are birds rain. around here. Food birds. <laughs> no, stop, stop, stop looking. Let me have one of those. <laughs> All right. Duh! Ooh! <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, you, yeah, you don't have to necessarily help move them. It's, it's okay. I can carry them down for you. How? <laughs> wow, you're not even breaking a sweat. Not you, Jasmine. You're... Just so uh, already. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, yeah. Not that there's anything wrong with that. I don't, I don't want to rush your answer, but what do you guys feel about staying in town and helping us out? Yes. Can oh, I sure. have these boxes for my house? <laughs> um, these boxes were actually for Jasmine's house. I can get you different boxes for your house. Empty box. I want the boxes. empty boxes. <laughs> what boxes? These are for me. Yeah, I had a lot of books lying around. Books? These yeah. are all books? Yep. I Every last one of them. Books. No I mean, wonder there's so... Thank you! I mean, I read a lot, oh but, like, I don't really have... I, I'm not I'm not the library type, you know? And I didn't... I don't I... want to mischaracterize you, but you kind of look like you are. I look at the huge stacks and stacks of boxes of books. You're not the library type? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This might come as a I... shock to you, but no, Box. not really. Yeah, <laughs> books. <laughs> 
Sorry, Ark. I... Thank you. <laughs> You're giving me an observatory. You're giving me books. <laughs> So I'm gonna hug Ariark <laughs> and Jasmine weeps openly. <laughs> <laughs> she is managing to keep her tears off Ariark. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, she kinda ruffles your hair. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, you're welcome. Um I'm just happy you guys like like the place, you know? Um I didn't wanna hmm. I didn't wanna sort of give you guys this, like like make it too big of a burden. She kinda like moves over with Jasmine hugging her uh, over to uh, Leota. Yeah, this Jasmine is... does not let go. Yeah. <laughs> gone. I, I mm. wandered off in the direction of the observatory. Oh, boy. <laughs> All right, then. Uh, she kind of, um, she reaches into her pocket. Your journal is great, uh, and I really like it, but um, Thank I've you. actually got my own journal that I've been working on as well. She kind of reaches into her pocket and kind of stretches it over, handing it to you. This was actually Ooh. held by a friend of mine for a while, the herbalist who lives here. Uh, but currently, it doesn't have a master. <clears throat> Would you mind filling it in for me, at least for now? Master? Not at all. This means I can have a book on each on each hip. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Draw. <laughs> Symmetry is very important. Ariark says, nodding, tapping both of her horns. Anyway, okay. <laughs> I like think you think so. Anyway, you guys are free I'm to use... I'm going to stop hugging Ariark, realizing that the boxes might, <laughs> might topple. You guys are free to use any of the installations in town um, to your whim. I assume you've already had breakfast. She kind of sniffs deeply. Wow, I can smell it on you. That smells delicious. Oh, it was incredible, yeah, frankly. We'd, I don't know if we can replicate it, but we'd be happy to make we some for you. Broomtail mumbles something in try. the background. You were nice enough to make us. <laughs> we should try and make it for you as well. Oh, don't worry about it. Um, especially today. What were you planning but I on will doing worry about anyway? It. Well, we couldn't find you, so we thought we'd just look around for Wonder. stories and oh. stuff to put in the book. Oh, that's brilliant. But you were saying that you wanted help around town, and that's yeah, what you what, do. Yeah, that was I, our plan I, I can never me. repay you. <laughs> <laughs> well, you guys are wanderers. You can help around town by doing what uh, doing what you do best. Wander. If you want to look around for stories, I can't think of anything better. All of Wayward's at your beck and call. Furthermore, if you want to return to the mainland, I can get you over there real fast. Uh, I your eyes went wide when you said that. Wayward, if, uh, <laughs> if everyone else is into that. Ar Ariark's methods of uh, transportation are dubious at best, but they certainly are efficient, Broomdale says huh. in the background. <laughs> Ariark has been nothing but good to us. <laughs> I yeah, I'd like to look around wayward. I there's so much we haven't seen. It's so full of good things. Okay. And it, there's an herbalist around here. She's and, not. She's not in town right now. Honestly, the only townsfolk who is is uh, Ariart. Kind of peers past you at Ferris. Digging in the sky. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Why don't you take Ferris with you? He's very useful. Of Is course. Help? Hello. Yeah, he brought us fish. He scampers to Ferris. his face, weaves a little bit back and forth, and then trots over. And here's yet another new mechanic. Um, the dog. Yes. Uh, in every single session, you can choose... Uh, every single session that starts in an area like this, you can choose who your companion will be. Right now, Ferris is your only real option. Um, Broomtail's uh, an unofficial fourth party member, so she doesn't count. Cool. However, uh, Ferris... Provides his own unique bonuses. Specifically, hmm. all of the bucks that are given to the dog are added to your own money pool. Ferris nice. is oh, oh, God. Ferris We're is as a result <laughs> broken. Of, yeah. The dog <laughs> continues to be broken. Furthermore, Ferris is good at hunting and can help you succeed on hunting checks. Um, this cool. is a secondary skill. Really, Ferris is the companion you bring along if you want to get flush. <laughs> <sighs> Now, the other two villagers who were in town can also add their own expertise once they return. Furthermore, if you expand the town and meet more people, they'll each have more options for you guys. However, I believed Ferris to be the best starting option. And the only one. Yes, yeah. That, yeah. that's why he's the only one. Yeah, I'm gonna pet Ferris. And be like, you, you want to come around Thank with you. us? And Yes. <laughs> Bucks. <laughs> yeah, bucks. 
Uh, Ferris kind of like tilts his head toward Ariark for a moment. Am I acting as a dog senator or just a normal dog? <laughs> <laughs> Ariark kind of kneels down, putting the giant heap of boxes next to her, uh, like a hand on Ferris's back. Wherever you go, your land goes with you. Your town goes <laughs> with you. You'll never give up the title of dog senator. <laughs> Thank you. I find politics very fulfilling. <laughs> <laughs> box box oh, yeah. oh my god we're gonna get that chef's knife before the yeah. session's out everyone. <laughs> we're gonna have that shop bought out <laughs> yeah i need to raise the costs <laughs> oh, you boy. did this to yourself yeah no you're gonna have the shop bought out before the shop even opens proper <laughs> oh no okay <laughs> Well, if you want to look around town, there are plenty of places to explore. I won't hold you back. <coughs> um, what, what would you recommend? Hmm. <laughs> it's all new to us. I don't want to wander and get lost in the woods or anything. Hmm. Unless well, there's something hiding there. Yeah, that, that's my thought exactly. Just follow your heart. Do whatever you think. I'm going to... Would it be rude of me to drop these off inside your house? <laughs> Not at all. You're always welcome. Ariark oh. lifts up, uh, lifts up the boxes again. Sort of smiles at you, eyes closed. Thank you. I'll take that to heart. Thank you. Uh, with a uh. big beaming smile, she kind of wanders off. You can tell she's very happy. It's almost like whenever whenever Ariark's happy, it's like the world itself seems to light up around her. It's like. That's that's not like <laughs> me being figurative or metaphorical or anything. Like literally, sunlight seems more intense uh -huh. around her. That whole nature yeah. spirit thing happening. Cool. Jasmine is beaming too. This has been a very good day so far. <laughs> so, where do you guys want to go? Um, is uh, your heart story. saying anything? Okay. <laughs> Lead the way. It's just walking off in a direction. I think I want to use wander. Oh, sweet, perfect. Oh. Uh, for the audience, can you? Second. Yeah, can you tell everybody what wander does? Absolutely. Well, I think I have the actual description from the book here. Um, Ooh. Wait. Or no, it's not. It's not from the book. It's it's homebrewed, so it's from Jay's homebrew. Oh, <laughs> essentially, oh, I'm just the, book. the brain am, book. Yeah. Yeah. I am just uh, foregoing a direction check and just. Following my instincts and striking out wherever I feel like instead. Okay. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Uh-huh. We're missing Quith up again. Oh, no. Oh, 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 boy. Yeah, um... Um... Quith, Quith up? Hmm. What attracts <laughs> foxes? <laughs> oh? Their names, I guess. <laughs> Box. 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 <laughs> I had to wait for Ariark to let me into your house. I was in your yep. home's books the whole time. Oh. And I ran oh, you back. didn't have to hold well, she is fast. Does no, Quithup no. have a box? Uh Quithup has an empty box. Yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh also, I'll have you know that I have <laughs> I, I have uh what uh. is it? Shared joy. I get plus one condition on a good deed. You do? Cool. Oh, so that bumps you up to ten nice. finally. That takes me to ten, which activates yeah. my trump card. Uh, eat, uh... which gives me plus two die <laughs> size when I have ten condition or more. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> wow. I love Quith up. Uh, yeah. Quith up has a, like, a secondary resource of his condition because every time he dances, his condition goes down. Hmm. Oh, he gets tired. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's I good. I get tired really fast. I put my whole heart into every dance. <laughs> Oh. Wow, that's a, that's adorable. <laughs> Thank you, Quithup. You um, want to see? <laughs> no, we should probably go first. <laughs> yeah, we're we're going to go wander around. I oh, think cool. Leona knows which way. Yep, and that is she spins around one and a half times and then points in a random direction. This way. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I can help out with this actually. Oh, uh. Broomtail oh. reaches down into her pack and hands you a a weird, like, straw doll with, like, unsettling uh, eyes on it. Uh, <laughs> okay. Another artifact? Toy? Nope. Play? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, this is a, this is a good luck charm. Oh. <laughs> 
it's it's super useful. It'll give you a. It'll give you like good good luck. Good things will happen if you have it. Okay. Can well, I have it? Can't hurt. How about I are use you, it first and then you can have it, Quip Up? Are you selling it to us? Okay. Nope. You can just have it. Oh, I grab thank you. It. Do I That's feel great. unsettled with it in my in my grasp? Oh, it's really unsettling, but you do feel luckier. Mm. I think all I of us you. have it. The good luck's for all of us, right? Oh, it's yeah. it's just for the person holding it. Oh, yeah, we well, we're sharing. <laughs> we're sharing. Uh, you guys can all have. We don't want to you take want. your good luck. Wait, you've got more? Yeah. Oh yeah, I've got plenty. Uh, weird. I mean, cool. Weird, but cool. You I know? feel. I'm starting to feel guilty about. All these gifts. Oh, no, no. These yeah. are... They'll come back to me in one way or another. Uh, Broomtale reaches into her pack and pulls out another one. This wait, is uh, this uh, is wait, more like a... Mean? This is more like a like a weird paper doll. She hands it to you, Jackson. It has, a, it has the weird medjet eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Thank nice. you. It's... Nice. Here, Broomtale, I found this for you. When I, just... Whenever I was waiting to put the books away. Oh, what, what is it? I hold out my hand. Uh-huh. <laughs> what is in your hand? <laughs> uh, I'm waiting for her to put her hand out. <laughs> <laughs> she's in a bowl. <laughs> she puts her hand out. I put in her hand a tiny crinkled leaf. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. It's very precious. Ferris jumps up and snatches it out of her hand. <laughs> no, that was for her to eat. He's delicious. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Jasmine's gonna put the little paper thing on the front of her hat thing. Oh, nice. Cool. So it's like a, it's like a hood ornament. Uh, <laughs> now that we have lucky one. charms, can I re-roll the wander check? We already had breakfast. Yeah, give give uh give that wander check another check. What, what is oh, that? No. Well, I guess we're taking the first one, unless I can do it one more time, in which case... No, you're fine. You're, you're taking the... Oh, wow. Okay, you can take it the third time. You sniff. I'll take the third one. I can, very I can use, we all uh, use our charms together. That's I can why. use Sniffer to give her a plus one bonus to her direction check. It's fine. Um, it's not a direction check, actually. Yeah, yeah. Oh, right. Shoot. It's yeah. a wander it is check. purely mm -hmm. wandering. Um, Good thought, though. Furthermore, your uh, your lucky charm is actually all of the good luck, and it is immediately spent, and it gets a plus one bonus. Um, the way uh, that Broomtail's class works, fortune teller, <laughs> is uh, it can throw you good good luck charms. Basically, it gives you a plus one on your next action. It's not that's cool. It's not super exciting, but it sure is functional. Cool. I, cool. I, I, I can like also, it. Uh, as you guys wander off, <laughs> um, she she kind of perks <laughs> up one. a bit. I, I can also read your fortune if you want. Oh, this is really fun That's... when she does this. What do you read it from? Uh, How do you? Interesting. What, do you, what exactly do you do, Broomtail? You've got all these artifacts, and you've got charms, and you've got fortunes, and he's oh. magic. I, I, oh. I, I'm not magic. Well, not in the tradition. I had my suspicions. Magic. Well, okay. Well, there's there certainly is magic in the world. Wonderful forces beyond our comprehension. But this is like. This is like on a on, a, on the next level up. This is this is fortunes. This is luck. I'm actually not She's traditional really magic. But anyway, if you guys want your fortune told, I can do that real quick. I've got a deck of cards. Sure. That sounds like fun. Okay. Yeah. I can only tell wow. one person's fortune per day. Like like really tell your fortune oh. per day. It it takes a lot out of me. So, whose fortune do you want told? I've already gotten enough for today. Why don't why don't one of you? In your fortune. Up, do you want to do you want to know what you have in store for the future? I wouldn't remember. Or what the future has? Oh. <laughs> hmm. Okay. Well, I guess that leaves me or the dog. Her eyes. And the dog Ferris? is busy looking at a tree. <laughs> <laughs> so let's well, do my fortune. Gosh. She sits down in front of you. Um, she sits down in front. Uh, <laughs> Too in the dirt. Though. Yeah, no, she leads you over <laughs> under a tree. She grabs you by the hand and leads you over under a tree and sort of sits down with her legs crossed. Okay, first things first, I'm going to lay out a few cards in front of you. I'm going to need you to okay. shuffle them back and forth, actually. Are we allowed to watch? Yeah, of course. Can I, can Jasmine I scoots over and looks intently. Yeah, I want to watch. What does that one mean? <laughs> um, 
Uh, Leota yes. shuffles the cards. These once cards twice. around. She actually she doesn't she doesn't lightning fast. You are surprised at just how quickly she's <laughs> oh. able to shuffle uh -oh. the cards around. Oh wow! <laughs> and oh. there you go. Bruntail has her eyes closed. She clo slowly reaches out. Tell me if I'm getting close. <laughs> like reaches out her hand for one of the cards. <laughs> um, warm. Okay. Okay. Warmer. Okay. Very cold. <laughs> <laughs> hand, hand on Leota's yeah. face. <laughs> Jasmine is just staring at Leota. Just, here, let's just, I, I'm gonna like gently take her wrist and lead her hand to, to the first card. You feel a third hand. <laughs> <laughs> she flips over the card and reveals your fortune for the day. Um, give me what you want predicted for this day. Like, what do you, what do you want, um, um, what do you want to be able to call in the future? Like, do you want to, hmm. you can, you can store a general purpose role for now. Like, I just, right. I, I want to know if I'll be super lucky today or not. Or you can, sp which will give you a role that you can sub in for any other role. Uh -huh. So like, a okay. general good fortune is that. Um, however, if you want a specific fortune, like, Will I find love today? Um, you yeah. can roll those dice, and I can give you a different result. Furthermore, okay. if you want to be like, will we fare well on the road today? Uh, you can yeah. roll your travel check now, actually, and um, mm. prepare for a future condition that way. It's The fortune is many-purposed. Yeah, I think I actually want to do that last one. I want to know how our traveling for the day is going to go. Okay, give me a roll. Good. Bad. <laughs> up? Do you know how to? <laughs> let well, let let her tell us. Well, it's not bad, is it? You got the fortune of the wonky woodsman. Uh, oh, in the, no, okay. not him again. <laughs> in the forty-five <laughs> quarters <laughs> position. <laughs> this isn't necessarily a bad fortune. You're just going to have completely average luck today. So, oh well. Okay. That sounds hey, we fine. We started to me. Out the day very strong. Yeah, just mm -hmm. plan accordingly, and everything will go per perfectly fine. Yeah, I think we can coast on how good things have been going, honestly. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um, fish coast. <laughs> I wonder what kind of bucks they are. <laughs> <laughs> bucks. Yeah. Bucks. Anyway, um, shall we get going? <clears throat> yes. Yeah. Sure. Broomtail oh, wait, we should stop and draw this spot really quick because we stopped here and it's probably important to Ariark. Are we right outside okay. the restaurant? Yeah, you're yes. like, you walk 10 feet away. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> it's quickly jotted down. And I mean quickly, and then you continue on your way. <laughs> uh, roll me a d3. Uh, that whom? is physically improbable anybody. Uh, Leota. Okay. One. One. Perfect. That's fine. Uh, that was just determining which location. Okay. Cool. Um, uh, you wander along, just, like, seeing the rest of Wayward. There are plenty <clears throat> of uh, abandoned houses, as you came to expect. Um, you wander to the main square, and then, Jasmine, your eyes actually perk up. Bobble standing out uh, amidst the darkness. Um, a path leads down through the woods and off to the side. Ooh. You can smell the sweet scent of, uh, I guess, I guess it'd be mint coming from down there. Ooh, what do you suppose is down there? Mint! Or wait, no, I wouldn't you... know that. <laughs> I wouldn't oh, know what it's you'd... called, but yeah, like... right. you would have like a yeah. some weird fox oh. name for it. Uh, the thing that tastes like snow. <laughs> oh, that's mint. Uh, ice. Mint? Oh, oh, right. <laughs> mint. Oh, right? Tastes like snow. Tastes like snow. What? what do you say we go down there? That sure. Mint is a good smell for exciting things. Is it? A, we can gather thing... a whole bunch to cook some fish in. We can eat it with some well, fish. Yeah, with some other or things. other you things. It, you can eat it raw too if you really want. Just oh, a little bit. <laughs> Just oh, no. a little bit. Um, is it deadly for foxes or something? No. Well, <laughs> in excess. <laughs> so, 
Just take it easy, Quitha. It'll be fine. Take it easy. Okay. <laughs> okay, so you head down <laughs> you head down the path. It the rocks stop eventually and you sort of like and the woods <laughs> thicken. You leave Wayward proper and enter a proper woodland. Um in the distance is a low thatched roof hut. <clears throat> Ferris is uh, bringing up the rear, like, very dedicatedly watching everyone's back. Does it look abandoned? It, it looks somewhat abandoned. Nobody's been here mm. for a while. Ferris, you recognize this place as Habib's hut, but yeah, I don't know if you'd share that with the group. Um, you, uh, but yeah, you, uh, your interesting group. Um, travels down this narrow pathway, Broomtail dragging along her giant cargo trailer behind and the dog following mm. in the very rear. Uh, the bird has taken to perching on top of the, uh, the collection of goods and is just oh, digging through the top the of it. <laughs> is, uh, is there mint growing? Uh, yeah, there's herbs of all types growing along it this. It smells like healthy it... around here. Are they wild or are they planted? Uh, they are, they appear to be wild enough, like, they've clearly been tended to, but, um, yeah. No, these were originally wild herbs. Okay. Ferris zips through the fields, chewing on mint plants. It tastes like small burning! <laughs> <laughs> Bucks. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take out some tiny clippers and clip off some mint. <laughs> Start putting it in little jars and toss it into my pack. I, I think I'll this is... grab a sprig of that and toss it into my mouth. Nice. Ooh. I, I grab this... a handful. Uh huh. <laughs> Not put... in excess. I take one out, put that in my mouth, and put the rest in my pockets. <laughs> Perfect. Okay. <laughs> See, now you can have some later too. Later? You won't run out. You. You know, you have more for later. You know, when you don't eat it all now. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I, I think I heard about this place. This is where the uh, the the uh, other herbalist on the uh, island lives. Oh, but she's what out of nice town. Rich lady. Yeah, she's out of town right now. Hmm. Oh, that's too bad. I told she's her to come nice here. Place. It's very. She's a witch lady. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. It, it kind of looks like it. Yeah. This is like a a witch house where like a kindly old witch lives. And oh, she's, really she's got young. a cauldron. Oh, is she kindly? Yes. She helps well, grandmas. <laughs> that's how I met her. Really? Were you helping a grandma too? Do you have I a grandma? Was. No. Oh. I don't know my parents. Oh. oh. I'm that's sorry. That's okay, though. <laughs> <laughs> Awkward silence? <laughs> no! Ferris can use his third ability, it's okay, to instantly resolve the situation. Fer yeah, I, I think Ferris yeah. is indeed going to enter the mix, kind of like rub up against Quithup's legs, flap his tail against, uh, against his waist <laughs> a little bit. instantly distracted. <laughs> and and pets Ferris okay. profusely. <laughs> oh. We have to be sure to meet her when she comes back. Do, do you think we could go inside? I want to check out the inside. Oh, I'm I... sure that Hoppy wouldn't mind. <laughs> Let's look in the windows. I don't know if we should be going inside. Oh, I really want to go inside. Um, there's probably lots oh, of cool things in there. Do... Well, there's probably lots of cool things and all sorts of witchy, exciting things in there. Broomtail... Yeah, I was testing Let's... the windows. Yeah, Broomtail you rushes up the windows the and starts peeking in. Yeah. Uh, Leota, do you see that over there? What do you what, see? What man? do you see? It's it's gro it's glowing. It's glowing in the dark. What is that? Whoa. Uh everybody I don't peeks. know, I can't tell. Everybody peeks in through the windows. Uh on Habib's uh table, everything's like scattered with Ooh. various witchy implements. A broom uh yes. haphazardly like floats back and forth, occasionally dusting something off, then coming to rest on the ground. Whoa. It's magic! Oh, it's a real, real magic. It's a real witch hut! It's a real witch hunt! <laughs> I've gotta record wait what? Oh, oh witch hut, not witch hunt. No! Oh, oh okay. gosh, no! Alright, wow, I got no. it. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to scare you. I didn't, I didn't know that's, 
that over there. That'd be for the switch I want to do is to find her and be yeah. friends. Uh, I don't want to. I don't want to like, burn her. Broom Taylor like grabs both of your heads and like points them at the table. There's a there's a softly glowing mushroom on it actually. <laughs> oh, it's it's like a magical witch mushroom. Yeah, a magical yeah. witch desk. Uh, don't let the dog in the hut. The dog the dog's going to eat that right away. <laughs> Yeah, we shouldn't we shouldn't enter the hut. That'd be very rude. And we ought to stop with one foot halfway through. through the window. <laughs> you, uh, <laughs> notice a shadow in the darkness that walks closer and says, oh, no. and points at the mushroom. Oh no! <laughs> no, quit up! Don't eat it! Don't, no! Don't eat no! It. Frantically admire gesturing. It. Just admire it. Have some mint with instead. With your eyes. <laughs> Okay. Is that the sound of your mouth full or talking through a window? Talking through a window. Oh, okay. Does the window have glass on it, actually? I thought it was, like, one of those open, like, classic witch windows. That's what I thought. Yeah. Well, the joke has unfortunately just... Yep. <laughs> so Quithip has something in his mouth. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Quithip has something else in his mouth. It's not the mushroom. Okay, good. Quithip, Quithip, come back out here. You can't just go in. You can't just go in people's houses. Broom Imagine tail. if someone went into your den. Broomtail and yeah, Leota. You can't just go in people's houses. Leota closes the window. Yeah, so Broomtail and Leota like, exchange <laughs> like very worried looks. Broomtail was like boosting Leota's leg up as she climbed in. <laughs> Jitu, stop that. This that. lady said that I was welcome at her house anytime. She's not there though. Oh, well, then there's no. Then there's no problem here. I open yeah. the up again, you guys. <laughs> No, I know her. She says it's okay. Mm-hmm. <laughs> right Don't eat her stuff. She said to not eat anything in her house. To eat nothing. So there we go. We won't eat anything in her house. It's okay, Jasmine. We're gathering stories. We're allowed to be here. Jasmine is looking around for any help. There is none. <laughs> <Nope>. All <sighs> right. Okay. We'll just stand there and not disturb anything. And not I'm disturb the broom. Her present. Oh, mm, why don't you leave it outside so she doesn't think that someone broke into her house and left something creepy? Creepy? Uh -huh. I wouldn't leave yeah. anything creepy. I put no, a rock it... on her desk. Mm. <laughs> Box. Okay. <laughs> okay. No, that's not creepy, Quithup. It's just unexpected to find. Very smooth rock. rock. It's a nice rock. Thank you. Uh, is that a witch rock or something? Where'd you find that? In it is pocket. a nice rock. <laughs> okay. I've been carrying it for a long, long time. Okay. I'm sure she'll appreciate it. You stare at the chromatic mushroom. Uh, this was Ooh. collected in the last session and is a, well, technically an artifact, and just by encountering it. Uh, <laughs> you unlock a new... <laughs> you do unlock a new system. Um, yeah, no, by, uh, by examining this chromatic mushroom, it's various colors reflecting across your eyes. Uh, you begin to appreciate the the world of herb lore, Leota. Um, mm. uh, you're not an herbalist yourself, but if you were, you would find this most exciting. Now, what the chromatic mushroom yeah. does when exposed to it is um, there's a very sparse table of herbs in the um, Ryutama book. All mm -hmm. that the chromatic mushroom does is dramatically, dramatically expand that. So, cool. oh, yeah, cool. no, this artifact oh, makes yeah. herbalism more relevant in more situations, is what I'd say. You can now find multiple different yeah. types of herbs across multiple different biomes. Normally, you can only really find sunset hime apples on grasslands, etc., mm -hmm. etc. Et However, there are now multiple herb types per area. Oh, cool. Wow, if only wow, you wow. were an herbalist. If only. Are there new herbs? I mean, this naturally well, hey, give it a Hey, give it a second here. Uh, Leota, like, examines this for a moment and then goes... Hey, Jasmine, this mushroom looks incredible, and I bet that you would know a lot more about it than I do. Um, it looks like a magic mushroom. Oh, I, I don't a think it's magic. magic it's, how? Just, it's just rainbow-colored. Everything in here is magic. <laughs> you mean can't it? You f can't you feel it in the air? Oh, With I should consider... Uh, happy I wonder if she'd make my house magic. Hold it up into the air. <laughs> mm. Well, I'm going to check out that right. mushroom and, I guess, gain ancient wisdom. Yeah, you gain ancient oh, wisdom. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I feel more wise. <laughs> well, are we uh, 
satisfied. I don't I don't mean to be a spoil sport, but this is not a good thing to be doing. Yeah, I mean it's okay. I, I we have free reign here. I write up a quick description of the room and its contents. Yeah, actually I I, I mean you have free reign? <laughs> no. She said that we can just stay here sometimes. Well, well, I guess I misunderstood. Well, there are extensive directions on this table, actually. Uh, <clears throat> Broomtail kind of points down. Uh, just in case somebody gets sick, in case of guests, in case of grandmas. Why is there a separate cr clause for specifically grandmas? <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe it's her thing. Yeah, I guess everybody's got to have a specialty. Um, yeah, ex instructions are pretty extensive, actually. Uh, I don't know. Maybe, maybe you notice on the sheet of paper it says, If I happen to be out while guests stop by, please help yourself to any refreshments contained within the blue cauldron. If Quithop is with you, please make sure he does not drink anything out of the red cauldron. I immediately, my head whips around looking at <laughs> the cauldrons and where Quithop is. Uh, Quithop is thankfully not going towards the red cauldron. Okay, all right. I'm going to sidle over towards that a little bit and look at what's in the red cauldron, I guess. Uh, some sort of, like, darker, darker mixture. It's difficult to tell in the mm -hmm. light, but it, it looks kind of oily. And I'm just going to put a sheet over that. <laughs> <laughs> wow, th everyone in this town is so nice. There aren't many people in this town, but everyone is nice. <laughs> yeah, now we're people in this town, too, so... We better be sure to be nice as well. I'm gonna yeah, I guess it's lucky that she's okay with people coming into our house then. <laughs> Broomtail bottles up uh, something in the uh, from the blue cauldron. Okay. It I've smells got, minty. I've got my refreshment for the road. Mm. What is it? I don't know. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it, it feels well, the cool. table said it was okay. Yeah. Hmm? I think we can like trust as her. you approach the cauldron, like it's colder <laughs> than the rest of the room, like hmm. refreshingly cold, not like harshly cold. I think I want to bottle some of this as well. If there's more left over. Oh yeah, there's, eating something. There's enough for everybody. No, I'm just too too dang intrigued. I I get a bottle of that myself. Can I have Do a bottle? Have sure. No. I'm Here, good. You Thank one. you. I just okay. want the bottle. Well, Oh, just the. Uh, I think I have a spare bottle here, but you know I it's drink glass, what's in the bottle so... and then just put the bottle in my pocket. No. Oh, okay. <laughs> Are you gonna put bugs in what? that? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> bugs. <laughs> what? What is? What is it? What's it taste like? Do you feel? I don't know. Ill? I'm saving it for later. It tastes like clean and snow and and kind of kind of like fizzy. Hmm. You, you'll tell me if you see spots, right? Huh? Spots? Like dots on your eyes, you know? If you see those? Yes. You'll tell me. I will tell you. If you see about those. Okay. spots. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Are you guys Jasmine done has here? prepared some more medicine just in case. That's a good idea. You guys about yeah. done? Let's keep wandering. Yeah, let's yeah. do it. Okay. Um, I, as we're exiting, I turn back into the room and thank you, broom. <laughs> the broom okay. uh, continues chipperly cleaning things. Um, you exit <clears throat> and stand in Habib's yard. Okay, where to next? Are you guys going to wander again? I, I don't know. I mean, I don't want to just decide that, so let's let's just ask everyone. Well, we can just wander in a random direction, or we can try and be, I don't know, smart about it. What do you well, feel, we don't really have We don't really have anywhere to go. I think wandering is fine, as long as we're not dangerously traipsing off into the woods or anything. I look wandering around at the woods in, in every direction. Yeah, right. <laughs> I want to go in the woods. Can we go in the woods? I'd love to go, let's in, the go in the woods. Let's go in the woods! It'd be a fun trip. To the woods! To the woods! Oh, okay. To the woods! Bruntail and Leota skip out in front of you. Uh, Quip Up is already gone. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you actually used the former check that you had, so you, you take a Oh, step. so I just do, do I do another, what, D2 now? Uh, no, 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 no. Um, 
you guys just wander off into the woods. Okay. Right. Um, after you traveling for... silly s- badger. No, no, no. You already passed him. But, um, no, you travel... <laughs> you travel deep into the woods. Um, the air gets significantly colder around you as you find your way around to the backside of the island, the uninhabited half. Occasionally mm. you pass a broken down building, but overall it's pretty quiet back here. The uninhabited half? I mean, the more, the <laughs> the never inhabited half. Let me <laughs> phrase it like that. What's it smell okay. like around here? Uh, uh, clean like you'd expect a forest to smell, but also hints of the ocean, considering you're now mm. on the ocean. It's smells a, good. It's a strange mix of smells. Um, let me relocate you guys. Okay. Mm, um, pretty. Yeah, flowers out your path, and you can wander freely. Can you guys give me um? Hmm. Actually, I, I want two checks. Can you give me a sniffer check, Quithup? Yes. And uh, <laughs> uh, Jasmine, can you give me an intelligence plus intelligence check? I can. And I'm picking flowers while they're being useful. <laughs> Yeah, no, Broomtail's with you, like, pointing at the flowers, <laughs> commenting on them, and occasionally laughing. <laughs> okay, here is Sniffer. Yeah. Good Sniffer. So you've got my intelligence good. is right above it. Ooh, okay. Ooh, very smart. Well done. Both of you stop simultaneously. Um, Jasmine, you notice something odd about the ground, actually, beneath your feet. Uh, everything <laughs> seems to give way in a surprising manner. Um... You notice... Like it's squishy? Yeah, it's a little squishy. Mm. Uh, Uh Like, taking a closer look, there's a thick layer of moss sitting over this, uh... uh, Sitting over the area you're traveling through. This isn't just normal grass. Furthermore... Moss is so close to the ocean. Quithop, you notice an, uh... Like, occasionally, there's a small gap within the moss, and you feel the the touch of an updraft. Hmm. I, I look at, uh, Jasmine... Is it dangerous? Jasmine bounces up and down a little. I don't think so. It's just moss. Very okay, thick layer of moss. <laughs> Excellent. Hmm? I just throw myself into digging. Excellent. And am immediately very dirty. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. He makes Is it look it? really fun. Yeah. <laughs> at, the mention, at the mention of very dirty, you see... um. Brimtail off in the distance, continuing to be covered in grime. She's just doing other things. Yeah. Oh, and actually, as soon as soon as you start digging, Ferris sees what's happening, jumps <laughs> over, goes right next to you, and starts digging a separate hole. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you two get to digging immediately. Um, give me a uh, strength plus strength. Okay. How what deep is, is it? Strength. Uh, as deep Ferris, as I want. you're fine. <laughs> Oof. That's really good. Like, that's that's average. Oh, okay. Um, it's, well, that's average for you. It is better than average for most people because, you know, d- six is average in this game. True. Mm-hmm. And um, I have that sweet plus two to dice size because of eat. Eat. <laughs> um, <sighs> okay, yeah, you, uh, <sighs> you quickly dig and surprisingly enough, you you expect to strike, like, I don't know, some sort of big rock or something. You do strike stone. However, it's smooth. Digging away on all sides of it, you quickly expose the top of something. Stonework, another smooth rock? Stonework that goes in every direction. You're wow, clearly wow, on top wow. of something here. It's it's a ruin of some sort. This is incredible. I'm going to start sketching it. A, a ruin? And we're on it? I start, like... Much like an archaeologist, I start brushing it with my tail so that it gets ah. clean. Oh, that's great. Dude. Uh, Bucks. Bucks, yeah. yeah. Um, Ferris, do you know what this is? Ah, uh, it's a rock. <laughs> yes. It's a big rock. <laughs> yes. Too big to eat. Yeah. <laughs> <Bucks>. <laughs> uh, broomtail, like, comes up behind you and, like, having made a flower crown, kind of, like, half... Uh, <laughs> Yeah, unceremoniously, like, just puts it on top of Leota's head. Oh, you found something. Yeah. Jasmine audibly goes, oh. <laughs> yeah. yeah. What? I, I I put together all the nice flowers. We found a lot of nice flowers. I can make you one, too, if oh. you want. Thanks, Broomtail. Oh, can I have one, too? 
Only if you want to. Only if you I think. Only if you don't eat it, Quithop. Up... <laughs> so, <laughs> has anyone, is anyone familiar with, with ruin from my crown? <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what would be ruined here. It's a good question. I don't know. Oh, do you think maybe it's a big stone troll? <laughs> it could, could be. <laughs> I don't know what that is, though. It's a big, it's a huge person you... that's buried underground sometimes. <laughs> that that sounds pretty dangerous. Do you do you guys want to excavate it? I'm I'm super interested. I can help dig. Well, yeah. Let's take a look around. See if there's any more coming out from the earth, and we can clear off some moss. Dig, 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 dig. Okay. Oh, I keep digging. Exciting. We found. We actually found something. Right. It could be anything. It could be an ancient library. Or maybe like a restaurant or something. Or I hope it's not books. I guess it could also be a bathroom. Hmm. Retail rolls. Hmm. Big not troll. Too well. Uh, should I roll again? Yes. Broomtail right, immediately right. gets alongside Quithop and starts digging. Okay. Wow. We've got some hmm. got some good diggers. Dig, dig, dig. In a in a matter of moments, you manage to scale all the moss back and away from um from what appears to be a. Uh, well, you pull it back, and, uh, God, the intricate stonework seems to lead to a singular point. Driving, driving your digging expedition towards that point, you, uh, you touch something hard, your nail impacting the side of Ow. something metallic. Jasmine puts her fairly useless spade back into her pack. Hmm. Let it be known that I have put some of the moss in my mouth. <laughs> oh my God. Would I know okay. if this moss is poisonous or not? Uh, yeah, you would. It's just normal moss. You're fine. All right. Um, okay. Yeah. I keep my mouth shut. <laughs> further investigating whatever this thing is you found in the ground, you find it to be a great handle. Uh, oh. You take hey. a few. You take a few more minutes. Excavate around what appears to be a door. And... Keep digging, Ferris. I'll try to pull it out. Is this like a store, okay. straight, a door straight down? Yes. Interesting. Uh, here, I'll help. I probably won't help, but I can try. Okay, Broomtail gets on the other side and pulls as well. Still Ferris is digging in such a way that he like showers dirt <laughs> over everyone who's yes. trying to help with this. <laughs> <clears throat> Hugging on the handle. I think. Yeah, I'll help with that as well. Yeah. Broomtail kind of just like does. It's a big handle, right? So we can kind of all get in on this. Yeah, no. Broomtail kind of just like walks up to it, puts both of her hands on, and just yeah, pulls it back, yeah. like snapping it open. Uh, yeah. What should I roll? Oh, you're fine. Right. No, <laughs> like, okay. Broomtail did it. Broomtail and Leota. Okay. Broomtail oh. and Leota like killed it. Nice. I uh, forgot yeah, that they're like really super strong. strong. Yeah. No. Either yeah. both get on either side of it and just hop. Immediately pull it open in opposite directions. Uh, Broomtail walks over for a high five. Yeah, good job. Uh, wow. A cascade of light enters the ruins below. Um, staring wow. straight down into the gap, <laughs> you notice uh, you notice the thin beam inter uh, the thin beam of light interrupting a lot of dusty air. It's a long way down to the bottom, but you believe you see something down in the depth. I'll go first. I already have it. Ever... Wait. I, I, I already have a torch out, and I'm trying to light it. <laughs> oh, perfect. Uh, did Quithop jump in? Yes. Oh, my God. <laughs> how deep, it, it's, how it's, deep does it look? It is very deep. Wait, actually, I'm lighting a lantern, not a torch. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, wait. Let, let me revise. Is it straight down, or is it like a stairway? It is straight down. Oh, okay. I did not jump in and die then. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was going to be like, okay, somebody Revisionist just grabbed Quithop. history. <laughs> Um, yeah. uh, I'm gonna throw a torch down, a lit torch, I wanna go, I wanna go, and keep down, keep a go. lantern on us so we yeah. can get an idea of distance. Okay, uh, Leota does that while Jasmine and Broomtail <laughs> hold back with them. Broomtail <laughs> yeah, exchanges I, uh, sympathetic, I'm just vibrating excitedly. Broomtail exchanges sympathetic glances with uh, Jasmine. I understand how he feels, though. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's just get a little bit closer. We can peek over. Uh, it falls, yeah, no. Uh, the torch touches down on the ground, illuminating the, uh, the ruin below. Taking a look around, there doesn't appear to be any point of access. Are you, like, sticking your head in the hole and looking around inside? 
Yeah, I think so. Okay, cool. Jasmine is like hands and knees on the on the edge, <laughs> butt in the air, head in the hole, just. Same with Quith up tail yeah. flapping wildly. I think pretty much everybody is crowded around yeah. it like this. Yeah, yeah. Desmond yeah. looks a lot like Quith up right now. <laughs> there are, yeah, no, the fox people's tails are all sticking up in the air, probably wagging. Um, <laughs> Absolutely wagging. You stare really down. <laughs> there are a lot of tails in this group. Yeah, and off-puttingly, you notice something directly below yourself. Like... You stare back under your body. I'm doing this from Leota's perspective because, as she was the first to look. Um, looking straight back across the cavern, uh, you realize that you're not on solid ground. You're actually hanging. Uh, you're you're like on the lip of this great ruin, directly uh-huh. beneath where you uh, where you're currently leaning in. A little further back is a statue, something made out of stone and iron. Wow. What do you see? What do you see? What do you see? It's it's a statue. I can't I can't quite make out what it is, but it's made out of like big stone bricks and metal. And we've got to get down there. How do we get in? I don't know. Uh, It seems. uh, How deep is it? Can I tell? I'd say about fifty feet. (coughs) Well, it's really really deep, and you know, I thought I had some rope, but Leota rummages through a pack. I can't seem to find it. Yeah. Even if you did, that there's not a, enough rope to get down there. Yeah, that's a lot. Maybe we Maybe should there's another entrance. Down. Is this even an entrance? It's just a drop. Well, it does look like it extends for quite a while underground. We could we could fan out in the surrounding area. Somebody hold my legs. Brimdale stands there. Well, okay, I I sure. grab Brimdale's legs. Yeah, like panicked that she's about to jump in and <laughs> grab onto a leg. Okay. What are you planning? I, I think I know what you're planning. Yeah, yeah, hang me down there. I, I, I want to take a closer look. Oh, Liotta should probably do that. She's the strongest. Am I? That's all... Okay, we can... F- oh, this is a bad idea. We can I really want to see what's down there. I'll grab both legs. One of you grab one leg, and then one of you grab my legs? Okay, I'll grab the legs. It's <laughs> just a horrible tangle mishmash. <laughs> Uh, Jasmine, you feel a set of dog chompers set themselves into, like, your belt. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's great. Okay. Um, everybody give me a strength plus strength check. Okay. okay. For holding Broomtail. Oh, boy. <laughs> what? Oh, oh no. Here's my bad luck. Uh, did we get rolls from everybody? No, I accidentally messed mine up. <laughs> did you? That looks like a strength roll. Oh, did it? Go if your strength is d8, yeah, 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 yeah. No, you did it. You did, you did a two d8. I think that was uh, that was your former strength roll. Just uh, give me another. Oh, okay. I'm pretty sure that's the last one you did. I might be incorrect. Six. Okay, that's that's fine. Um, yeah, through your combined efforts, you all managed to just grab onto Brimtail and just like dangle her down a little bit into mm-hmm. the darkness. She peers around. Ooh, I see something. Stop wiggling, please. It's, <laughs> Tell it's me. Like, hmm, it's it's like a it's like a metal platform. Oh, the edge is kind of like it's broken down. Oh, I think I see the remi- oh, no. I I understand what's happening here. Here, pull me up. Pulling. Okay. okay. Just checking. Yeah. I shouldn't grab your tail, right? No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I you immediately pull... shout for her in response. Yeah, Brimtail cut like you pull Brimtail off and like she sits cross legged on the ground, breathing heavily. Uh, I don't understand why you wouldn't. She kind of like shrugs. It hurts. It's, it's another body part. But it hurts. It, can it's like, I? It's like a hand or a leg. No. Do you mind if I touched your tail just for a second? Yeah, go for it. While I explain, she puts up her finger, uh, she puts up a finger and, uh, explains the situation, as Jasmine presumably touches her tail. It's coarse. <laughs> uh, <laughs> as you'd expect. Um, now, on the inside, there seems to be some sort of a metal pa- platform that's bent downwards. If I had to guess, there was some sort of a support structure that connected up to this entrance. Wait, are you saying there's a slide in there? No, no, there's not a slide. <laughs> 
like there's some sort of I like a, excitedly towards the hole. There's like a there's like a walkway or something that was destroyed. If we can find a way to sort of bridge that gap, uh, we can support ourselves and climb our way down. There seems to be like a mm. like a scaffolding leading down. Just the part that connects it to the surface is damaged. What if I jump really far? That won't work. That's it's it's at not a, a good idea. It's at an odd angle, so we'll need to come up with something creative. Mm. Well, I'm not a good Does anybody at that. have some rope? Maybe we could secure a line on it somehow. I can it's... dance to make you smarter. That's not a bad idea. The rope, the rope part. I could, I could run back <laughs> to town and get some rope if you guys like. Hmm. How far away is town? It's like five, ten minutes if you like oh, really cool. booked it. Do you guys want to go back to town and get rope? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I don't. I can't think of any other way around it. So sure. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Okay. Let's head back and get some rope. You head back to the town of Wayward, um, using that and get some rope. And get some rope. Um, I get another empty box. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, um, have you been carrying the box around this whole time? Yes. Okay. You go up to the uh, you go up to the very tippy top of um, of uh, Wayward to find Ariark. Actually, yeah. I forgot to mention that as everyone gets up, you realize that Jasmine has been. Combing <laughs> Ringtail's tail Box. to little yeah, success. Bucks. Trying to get Bucks. the trap. Bucks. Um, yeah, <laughs> you head back to town and find Dariark in, uh, in her usual spot in the uh, in the city hall, finger quotes. Oh, what brings you guys back so early? We found a hole! We found a slide in a hole! We found yeah. underground ruins! Ruins? Do you know anything about the ruins? Ruins. They're ruins Here? under moss. Uh, uh, I didn't ruin anything. We found them. <laughs> no, we found it ruined. Hmm. Well, it I get like that when we got there. We don't we know if rope. it's a ruin, I guess. Do you need a... What do you want to borrow? Rope, you said? Rope. Mm -hmm. Do, and do and you want to see? Any equipment you might have. Do, do you, you want to see? Stairs? Ow. Hmm. <laughs> 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 oh my god. Ariark smiles kindly. Ah, this is your adventure, guys. I'll leave you to it. But I can let you sure it's you really might... cool? Oh, trust me, I'll read about it in the future. Okay. She lends guess... you a long length of rope. Any Thank chance you. you have a grappling hook, too? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a grappling hook would be if extremely useful. Can... I understand. Grappling hook. Uh, afraid I don't have one of those. Not even sure what mm. that is. Wait, that's fine. We do... We're fine with a rope. If you find anything, like, critical to the future of the town, please bring it back. Of course. Yes. Oh, I wonder what we're going to find. Anyway, have fun, kids. She kind of, like, waves you <laughs> off. Can I take a pan? Kids. <laughs> sure, <laughs> you can take a pan. Great. <laughs> okay. I look at the others and then look at myself. Do we look like kids? Mm. I, it's, I think it's an endearing term for her. She she used to call me the, that a lot while we were traveling together. Um, she oh, might, okay. She might call you that because she likes you. Oh. I don't really get that stuff, but okay. <laughs> I think she's old. I don't travel with people. That's, that's very rude, Quithup. No, it's not. I don't it's think rude. she looks very old, Quithup. She doesn't look old. Looks... But she's a dragon. Dragons don't get older. Well, but dragons can also be young, right? I oh, don't know anything about dragons. I don't understand any me of that. Neither. But I feel like hmm. we're making a lot of a lot of assumptions based on um. Based I have on... this pan. Okay. Maybe we Good should ask you. her next time. Unless it is rude. Hmm. And it, well, well, we'll see about that later. <laughs> <laughs> You return to the woods. Everybody's very mutually confused about dragons. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Now, uh, you guys grab me. Who's who's the most dexterous here, do you think? I Jasmine shakes her hand. hand. I look between everyone. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, well, well, I would assume it's the dancer, but... Mm, uh, you're probably right. I could... I look a little worried. <laughs> Yeah. I'm also pretty dexterous for what it's worth. I let. What exactly are you going to do? Let's leave it to Leota. Uh, and then Quithip, you can I... do one of your dances. Yeah. 
Oh, that's right. Here, you need to hold the pin if I'm gonna dance. <laughs> I give, I give Liotta the pan. Oh, that. Thank you. Here, here. Yes. I'll take I it. hand it to Jasmine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's a pan. Yep. So does this mean I get to go into the hole? Y yeah. Um. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's let's do that. I was uh, Brintail kind of looks between you and the bird. I was wondering if we could make like the bird fly in there, but I, it's still mad at me. I think. <laughs> uh, should I do? <laughs> should I dance to make you better at at being good at this? <laughs> yes, please. Yeah, I am. I admit, I am curious to see how that works. It is a um. Uh... It's a Dex plus uh, whichever uh, stat I'm trying to boost roll. <laughs> Uh, this is going Doris to... is marveling wordlessly at the size of this hole the whole time. I'm going to say that it is a dex check in order to secure this rope properly. Okay. Cool. Yeah, so like what I'm going to do is like, so you're lowering me down into the hole into the hole of bed, and I need to swing back and forth and land over on the platform so I can tie it off. Exactly. Is that right? Okay. Is that dance good enough? That dance is absolutely good enough. Nice. You feel so what does inspired. That do uh, you feel inspired by Quithip's little dance. Uh, and it increases your dex die by one size for your oh, cool. next so, thingy. Wonderful. I'll roll. I'll roll two d eight then. Jasmine is excited. Yeah. Well, yeah. It Holy crap! Yeah. Oh my. Very good. Very good. You um. Everybody except for Quithop, who's dancing, lowers Leona <laughs> into the hole. Okay. Okay. Back and forth, Jasmine, with me. One two one, one two, two one two one two go. What are we? Really? <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 <laughs> what are we doing? I swing forward, briefly find no purchase, and then land on the metal platform. I got it. You did it. Yep. Good one job. Sec, I'm tying it off. I I look for like a secure uh, piece of metal or just structural whatever to tie this off on. Okay. You do so. Great. Now what? Now, um, I pull out a lantern to light up the area so that everyone else can come down. Now, if we just dangle but... off of this rope, we could probably scrumble our way on over there. I'm good at scrumbling. <laughs> Jasmine hmm. just head swiftly turns <laughs> to look at Broomtail and she frowns. <laughs> oh, you, should, um, tie it. you should tie the other end of that rope to a tree or something if okay. you haven't already. Can do. Broomtail runs over and ties it to a tree immediately. Great. Uh, she kind of like okay. touches the flower crown on her head like, hmm, and then puts it on the bird like leaving it up here. <laughs> no, she puts it on Ferris who has to stay up here. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Okay. Ferris oh, feels very okay. pretty and lasers in the sun as everyone else goes down into the hole. <laughs> I'll wait up here for everybody else to get down wait. because I want everyone to be safe. I don't understand. Okay, so we've tied a rope. Yeah, no. Uh, so imagine this. There's a rope that is tied to a tree going down oh. into the hole a ways. It, Jackson understands. Oh, okay. Jasmine does not. Okay, it's simple. My you just. You put your foot, you grab the rope with both your hands and let your weight dangle below it. And mm -hmm. then the fact that it's connected to the little platform underneath will let us functionally hang on it and drag ourselves over. Yeah. Have you ever shimmied before, Jam Jasmine? Jasmine frowns harder. <laughs> oh, I can dance you better at it. <laughs> Are you... It's okay. I'll be here to, I'll be here to help catch you. Are you dropping your uh, condition by an equivalent amount for each of these? Yeah. Uh, Faust? Yes. Excellent. Okay. I've already lost two conditions since I no longer Oh, wait. I didn't, I didn't realize that there was equivalent exchange involved. Yeah, there's there is. <laughs> oh, no. yeah. Dancing is powerful. <laughs> okay. Like I said, I put my whole heart into every dance. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> it's getting weaker. <laughs> Oh my god. Okay. I am less excited than I was about this. <laughs> this is this is, is the it... very basics of ru ruin exploration, Jasmine. It's exciting. Come on, it's an adventure. This is the basics? I know I really want to see what's inside. I'm also terrified all of a sudden. <laughs> Jasmine goes over and tests out the rope, sees that it's uh secure and just dandy. Okay. All right. 
I'll wait oh, up here. Okay. And Liana's down you there. You can do it, Jasmine. And we'll make sure that you're safe. Yep. All right. So I just... Uh, mm, just grab it with yeah. your hands. All right. All right, I got it. I got it. It probably doesn't hurt to get your feet up there, too. What? Okay. <laughs> Jasmine is... You can do it. You can do it. ...tangled on the rope. Oh, no. Uh, okay. Now I shimmy down yep. above the ground. There you go. Oh, God, you better catch me. <laughs> <laughs> Should I roll for this? Or... Uh, yeah, it's not, it's not going to be a hard check. What do I roll? Dex? Uh, strength plus dex? Strength. Yeah, that makes sense. Sounds fair. <clears throat> oh, yeah. No, uh, you make it, like, you were incredibly Great. nervous. Broomtail cheers you on, like, it tries to encourage you. But surprisingly, you just, uh, the second... You touch the rope and like start to hang. You feel you feel the great height beneath you, like your stomach turns. However, like that panic sort of steals you. You you lock on it like a vice grip and just <laughs> move like you feel you feel like the like a ringing in your ears, like all the blood flows to your head, and then the next thing you know, you're just inside the cavern. Like you don't know how you got here. <laughs> Uh, Jasmine is just clutching this railing, breathing heavily and staring <laughs> off somewhere. <laughs> Good job, you nailed it. She doesn't Good care. Good job, you. Jasmine. You feel you feel a hand on your leg, Jasmine, like as you're standing on the very edge. She doesn't notice. <laughs> yeah, Broomtail, like, scrumbling behind her, kind of, like, grabs onto Jasmine's leg a bit and uses it to, like, steady herself and, like, scramble oh. onto the platform. <laughs> oh, okay. You did it, Jasmine. That was that was extremely cool. Jasmine is vibrating a bit, but she's <laughs> oh, starting no. to recognize people again. <laughs> yeah, hair ruffling intensifies from Broomtail, like, followed by shh, shh, <laughs> shh. I'm good. I'm good. I'm all right. We'll leave getting out of here until later. <laughs> Can't think about that right now. Quit up your next. <laughs> okay, Ferris. I'm gonna go into the hole. Can you watch this for me? I put down the jar that I got earlier. It's full of a couple bugs. <laughs> yes, they will be very safe. Okay. <laughs> you... <laughs> Thank you. Ferris kind of holds it between his two front paws while he's lying down. <laughs> oh. I nod proudly at Ferris and uh, start to scrumble down the hole. Dex and strength, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, it's not as bad as you think. It's kind of like dancing, but upside down. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Nice. That, I don't know if that wow. was the right thing. You did. I think you did. I, I believe Just your stats are 8844. Right. No. Uh, one oh. of those should have... I don't think it Bird saved whenever meat. I reduced it. Hmm. Hold on, let me look at that. Oh, no! Oh, the bugs! <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, one of those should have been a D6. So let me roll that again and see if it does it right. that? <clears throat> Yeah, there we Jesus! Go. Oh wow. my god! Okay, Faust. Yeah, Quithup just like, almost, Quithup ignoring the rope just grabs the edge of the thing and hop, it swings himself down, <laughs> clearing it in a single yeah. jump. I got it! See, I told you, it would have worked if I just jumped really far. <laughs> <laughs> I, well, I, I guess, guess so. I, yeah, I guess <laughs> I'm wrong. Everyone kind of yeah. like sheepishly. Wow. <laughs> Jasmine just opens and closes her mouth. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, do you guys want to explore this cavern? There's probably so much yes. ancient stuff down here. I want ancient lighting stuff. Lighting up my lantern. Okay. okay. So is is this is there like stairs down or something? Yeah, this is a scaffolding what? leading down. Oh, okay. Cool. Let's do it. But I'm um I'm kind of scared of the dark. Can somebody turn on a light? And I, I just realized I'm now. terrified of heights. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
Ferris, okay, uh, no, not Ferris. Quith up. It's okay. I have this lantern. Come over. Come over near this. Yeah. Come, okay. Let's let's just all stand together. <laughs> yes. Everybody groups together and slowly travels down the scaffolding. Keep together, just nice and close together. Within, you know, grabbing and pulling up off the edge. Yeah, distance. I'll stand. I'll stand next to the edge so you don't have to. Uh, let, let, none of us stand next to the edge then. Back from the, from the let's edge. just not yeah. stand near the edge. <laughs> <sighs> Closer, everyone. We're already really close, though. Yeah. It never hurt to be close. <laughs> you guys are my friends. Mm -hmm. close. Oh, you're my friend, too. Oh, you think I'm a friend? Yeah, and friends don't let friends plummet. <laughs> they don't. Box. <laughs> yeah, Box. <laughs> Ooh, what do you think that is? Oh, what do you think this is? Broomtail's like, or Tail's whacking you in the face occasionally in the midst of all of this. I think there's a lot of Tail Tasman whacking does going not on. back yeah. up. Yeah. yeah. I barely even notice it. My eyes are yeah. wide. This... I am looking it... at everything. Okay. The yeah, it is worth it for Jasmine just to. Yeah. <laughs> you touch down. You eventually touch down on the ground floor. The path that Broomtail and I walk, once dusty, is no longer dusty. <laughs> Bucks. <laughs> Bucks, yeah. We, we did it! The Is adrenaline that... has fueled Jasmine's excitement now. Good job! You conquered, you conquered your fear of heights, Jasmine! Good For job. now, yeah! We're really adventuring! <laughs> yeah, you're really... We're proper ruins explorers! I've never explored a ruin! Are you hyperventilating? <laughs> Oh, don't be too much. There's a lot of dust. <laughs> okay. First things first, we need to set up a base camp. Yes. I want How to long are we going to be in here? Oh, there's so much to do. There's, there's a lot to do. Uh, but first things first, let's set up a base camp. Great. Right. I'll get a fire right. going. Yeah. Let's do it. Desmond is jogging in place. <laughs> we probably don't need a fire yet. I'll just set up a tent. Quithip, I want a fire. Do you think you could? Yeah, a fire would be good. Quithip, do you think okay, you could fire it is. sniff out the way out? I'm good at sniffing. I mean, we could go back the way we came, but there's still a chance we could find some other exit. A better one. <laughs> a shortcut. A shortcut indeed. Okay, I'll um, yeah. I'll set up a like a little tent enclosure. Ooh, we could set Ooh, up something. What do I do? Okay. Um, what do I do? What do I do? Uh, do you want to set up the fire? Sure. Wait, isn't Leota doing that? Whatever, I'll help. <laughs> Quithup wanders away. Yeah, Quithup wanders away to find an exit. That's not a good roll. That's Don't not, go too far. It's not a good roll at all. Yeah, Quithup paces the fire roll. Okay. You get a fire and tent set up within moments. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, uh, Jasmine, you can help me sort of like, okay, let's, let's set things up inside the tent. We need to like have yes. a proper archaeological thing. Like, oh man, <clears throat> like we gotta have a oh. cool set. I didn't bring a table, but we can set up on the floor. Broomtail okay. Starts, Broomtail starts setting up like papers on the floor to take notes on. Yes, uh, Leota, did you bring that brush? I've got this spade yeah, sure. and these clippers. These are like mm -hmm. archaeology tools, right? I take out a small brush. It's got some fish gunk on it, but you can clean that off. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna roll for a, a camp check. Perfect. To see how cool our sitch is. Hmm. It's fine. Yeah, no, it's pretty good. Um, yeah, you've you've adequately set up a base camp. Okay, we'll call this base camp alpha or something. Base camp alpha. Ooh, yeah. Hey, that sounds good. Word. I like it. Uh, everybody somehow like Broomtail. Uh. Her, her stock is always eclectic. She does seem to always have a tent and folding chairs on her, regardless of what the situation <laughs> is. So you set up a few folding wow. chairs, sit around the fire, and start to converse. Okay, how do you want to tackle exploring this quick, ruin? Quick question. Am I exited the scene, or...? <laughs> you can wander back in whenever you want. Okay. So how do you guys want to go about exploring this ruin? Well, I think that we should probably all stay together. It seems like it would be really, really easy to get lost here. Okay. Yes. I wander back into their gathering. I didn't find an exit off on my on my lonesome by myself. <laughs> 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 no. That's okay, Quithup. We're going to stick together from here on out, okay? 
Yes. <laughs> <laughs> now guys there's one important thing we got to remember about this place it's going to be really dark in here and it can be easy to lose track of time that door's going to stay open so we'll use that as our skylight uh broomtail point straight up we've got to make sure not to uh let's whenever night rolls around just to keep our sleep cycles straight let's go to sleep okay, okay. yeah yes sure and maybe I mean, if we get tired because we used up so much energy panicking, we can take naps. <laughs> hmm. Okay, so... Are you implying that you need a nap right now? No. And... No, I've still got... I, my blood is on fire. <laughs> I don't... I oh, don't careful! Be... I, you're not supposed to agitate your blood too much! <laughs> oh my god. I don't want to be morbid, but if we get caught in a bad situation at night, we'll have no way to designate our own exit. That skylight will go mm -hmm. out, and it'll be hard to find our way out. Basically, um, so should we should we leave when night starts to fall? In that case, that sounds good. We can, okay, yeah, we can we can leave some sort of trail so we don't get lost. Oh, that's perfect. Um, good idea. Um, Do I have anything? No, in my and I left my bug jar up with Ferris. <laughs> 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 okay, so, uh. How are you guys going to do this? Are you going to try to explore the ruin together? Yeah, I think yes. so. Okay, one um, after the other. I have. Oh, sorry. Go ahead. One after the other. I'm going to want a um. I'm going to want a set of rolls from you guys, depending on how you're going to explore this uh, place. You're each going to take a turn leading. Cool. Cool. Okay, who wants to go first? Me. <laughs> okay. Okay, Quitha. It, okay. it can be you. Sniff us, sniff us some interesting things. I need to sniff um, better this time. So, oh, before we set off, I want to do a trail of breadcrumbs type thing. Ooh, but nice. all I have is a bar of soap, so I'm going to cut that up <laughs> into a lot of really small little <laughs> white chunks. Oh, that's no, 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 this, this will work, this will work. Unless Quithup eats them. Unless Quithup eats the goddamn soap. No. <laughs> tastes bad, I wouldn't eat soap. <laughs> okay, if you say Good so. Then. So yeah, I'm just I'm gonna cut those into as into as small chunks as I can and leave them behind us. <laughs> okay, well, um, yeah. There You're... is the sniff. It is bad. Oh my god. Oh, yeah. You follow Cliff up around for a full hour, and he just leads you right back to camp. <laughs> <laughs> It's hard to smell things down here. Good good job, Quithup. You found the camp again. <laughs> yeah, I did. <laughs> wow. And we didn't I even get the rest of the crew. <laughs> yeah. Hooray. We didn't even cross our own soap trail. I'm actually <laughs> shocked that that happened. Yeah. Huh. Nice job, Quithup. Okay, I'm done. Uh, Jasmine, you should lead us next. Oh, um, okay. Uh, we haven't gone this way. That way it is. Uh, give me a, give me an intelligence plus intelligence. Cool. And let it click, click, click. Seven. Nice. Okay. Uh, you case the outside of this first room that you've entered. Particularly, the great stone structure seems to attract your attention. Approaching oh yeah, it, there's a statue. Yeah, approaching it, you hold your torch up. It's it's a giant statue towering over you guys. However, with your keen insight, you do notice a ladder almost leading up to its chest portion. Oh, there's a ladder leading up to its chest. Uh, anybody want to climb that? Me. <laughs> I, I, Be careful. I, I, I would like to. Oh no, it's okay. It's it's. Quithups. Yeah, Quithup, you can do it. Thank you. Do you want to go? I, I really do. There might be artifacts up there. Okay, you can go. Fruitail hmm? scrambles up the ladder. All right, I'll stay here. <laughs> she disappears for like a full 30 seconds. Um, Where? Like for, into the dark. You're not sure. Oh. Did you want the lantern? Never mind. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> So, I don't know if this is a little insulting, but do fox people have some kind of nocturnal vision? Some of us do. Do you? No. Oh. <laughs> I'm good at dancing. 
You hear a, uh, like, ee! as uh, she slides back down the ladder. <laughs> um, she lands next to you, something clutched in her teeth. <clears throat> Guys, I found something. I found something really good. What is it? What, what is it? What is it? And fire. She holds up a mirror. Whoa. It's me. <laughs> is it interesting? Is it, is it pretty? It's, yeah, it's a beautiful <laughs> mirror. mirror. No, however, when you look at it. However, it is cracked. Hmm. Oh, I, I, Why is I, that I, up on a statue? I, I don't know. I found I found it sort of like tucked into the statue. Just look at it; it's beautiful. Yeah. Wow. It's too bad it's already a little broken. Here, let's let's wrap it up in some cloth so it doesn't break anymore. I touch it. Okay. You touch, <laughs> you touch the mirror. Uh, Leota, my uh, would you mind rolling me an intelligence plus intelligence check? Not at all. Yeah. Is this? I you're the artifact master. Huh. What? <laughs> right about now. Are you asking? Um, <laughs> are you asking Broomtail? Yes. Okay. Cool. Do you, is this? I. I mean, it strikes me as an artifact, an old mirror. That seems very mm. artifacty. Am I wrong? Uh, she looks down at it. Hmm. I have. I have some theories about what it could be, but I don't. I don't want to spoil the surprise if 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 that's actually the case. So I'm not going to say anything about it quite yet. But I will hold on to it for you. I'm still touching. Okay. She, okay. Do you, do you want to carry the mirror? No. <laughs> Jasmine lets out a sigh of relief. <laughs> uh, Broomtail wraps the mirror. Okay, this is this is our our group's artifact. I I won't take this one. This is everybody's. Okay. Well, I you climbed the ladder, but no, no, no. This is this oh, is it... everyone's. This oh, this, this is good. We're all friends. We're we're all gonna share this. Nice. Um. <sighs> Uh, I've never had friends like these. Oh, that's that's so sweet. Aww. Um, Leota, do you yes. want to take the lead this time? Absolutely. Yes. Yes. Leota like jumps to her feet, very eager to do so. Okay. Blah. Nice. No, that's once again that is like that's the equivalent of rolling a thirteen or a fourteen. Oh, okay. Um, Why not? Yeah, no, like, Ryutama, you gotta think about the average, it's, that's good. Um, mm -hmm. But, uh, yeah. Uh, Leota kinda, like, leads you away. She discovers a side passageway uh, where the, um, like, that you wouldn't have noticed in the dark unless you'd really approached it. It seems to be mm -hmm. more human-shaped, less, less gigantic than Ooh, uh, nice. the rest of this place. Ooh, good a human-shaped hole, you say? No! No! <laughs> no. Uh, no. <laughs> no! Take that away from here. This, this is a good place. Yeah. You, uh, <laughs> Sorry. Oh, 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 let's go down here. Let's go down here. Oh, this is perfectly sized for us. Yep. <clears throat> All right. Good, good find, Leota. Uh, Thanks. Broom, Broomtail kind of, like, eagerly charges a little bit into the dark. Um, I charge after Broomtail. You stick together, everyone. Yeah, you, please. You never know when there's more cliffs. You frequently <laughs> forgetting that I'm afraid of the dark. I have charged after Broomtail. <laughs> oh, I'm Box. like the group. Yeah, the group moves together, um, mostly through these dark, um, through these dark passageways. You find a you find a door off the side of the hallway. Ooh, is it what open? kind of door? It is closed, and it is oh. made of metal. <clears throat> Hmm. Should, should it, we open it? Did Broomtail and I find it, or did we Maybe. just be? The entire group found it. Oh, okay. Look at the handle with some wooden utensils. Nothing happens. Just a normal iron yeah. door. So I try to open it. Then. Yeah. Does it have like a visible handle? It or... does. Oh, okay. I tug on the handle. <laughs> <laughs> I, I believe Leota was already doing it. Um, <laughs> No, I think that I think that I like start reaching for it, and then Quipa <laughs> just like jumps in. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Quipa yanks open the door. Got it. You look into the darkness, <laughs> and you see stacked one on top of the other beds. Whoa! Oh, what? What kind of place That's... is this? Weird. Maybe it's a That's... house. Yeah, I'm gonna I enter the storage. room and. Huh. I... Wait, are these bunk beds or yeah, like bunk stacked? Beds. Oh. <laughs> oh, okay. This place is weird. I go in and start laying down on one of the beds. <laughs> you lay down on one of the beds. How Man. is it? Very nice. <laughs> oh. You know, I've I haven't really been exploring ruins before, but is this normal? I 
I don't believe it is. Oh, it looks like like a like a dorm room or something. Uh, what? A dorm room. <laughs> I went oh, to college, you know. What's I that? I don't know that word. I don't know. It's an organization of people who group together for the betterment of learning. That sounds wow. incredible. That sound, yeah, that wow. It's a pretty nice <laughs> place, yeah. That sounds dangerous. Is it is this college? Uh, kind of reminds me of it a bit, but it's a little too old. If I had to guess, Broomtail kind of, like, runs her finger through the dust and then, like, sniffs at it. This place is a hundred years old, maybe more. I wow. sniff at what Broomtail just sniffed at? <laughs> you do so. Her Not finger? Be out-sniffed. <laughs> <laughs> huh. So, you don't know what this place is? It's... It's really big, but it's got this small room with beds and Yep. Was there anything yeah. else of note in the room? Um Yeah, there are like there are a few trunks set around the room. If you oh, want yeah, to pop those up. Go. Oh you know I do. <laughs> <laughs> you find some very, very outdated clothing. Some of them are perforated with moth holes, but like wow. very bright colors. One of them has a cape. Like <laughs> It's it's you audacious. Mean a blanket. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, it's very it's... audacious clothing. Like, is this college stuff? No, no. This is this is the style a hundred years ago. Everybody used to they they dressed in very bright colors. So bright, I don't know if I'll be able to go to sleep. Yeah, with even it. even in the dark, this <laughs> is. Wow, I think it's glowing. Uh, I, Leota, you find a uh, you find a doll made out of a strange material it's it's like part metal part like i don't know it's not it's not hard it can kind of take some pressure to it um huh yeah uh it it's shaped it's sort of shaped like a person interesting i think i found some sort of toy here a toy jumps out of bed throws the blanket aside (laughs) it's like a doll see i hold it out so quethup can say yeah you hold it up I go to, like, grab it? Oh, wait, can I touch it? Yeah. Of course. I Please, here. Okay. I just kind of poke it, like the <laughs> Pillsbury Doughboy thing. Yeah. Um, you know how to hold it? Yeah, no, it's 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 hard. Um, But, like, yeah, no, that's it. You, you get is a feel for its texture. It is posable. Uh, nice. <laughs> there, there is a button on its back. There's a what? A, what? a button on its back. Oh, I press it. I think I found a mechanism. Something spring-loaded releases in its arm, making the arm fly <gasps> clear across the room. Oh! oh! I jump for cover. What was that? Are you okay. Uh, what was that? Who's okay, throwing I think things? It's a weapon. I think it's just part of the toy. It, is it? Where'd the arm go? Did you break it? <laughs> oh, I got no, it! I got I it! I got it! Supposed to do that. Uh, if okay. it's a college thing. Broomtail grabs it and then slots it right back into the uh, right back into whatever. Oh, look, this it thing has is. a little a little coil of metal so that it shoots out. You fixed out. it again. Oh, I think it's supposed to do that. I Clipper. love it. What? Clipper. Can I see? Can I try? Wait, is this an yeah. artifact? Uh, yeah, probably. Why not? Here, Quetha, uh, you press this right here. Oh, I I sit down, fold my tail around, and shoot the hand into my tail. <laughs> it hurts. Wow. It's it's got some punch to it. Huh? Wait, did you say it hurts? Yeah, it hurts a little bit. Oh. <laughs> I don't like it. I give it back to Liana. <laughs> Fluff the thing out of my tail and walk I away. I love it. Broomtail kind Broomtail, of this is for you. Oh, oh, I love it so much. Thank you. Thank you so much. She hugs you. You're welcome. Oh. oh this has been a great expedition so far. We've already found so much. Yeah, we're finding proper treasures. I bet there's even unexpected more to find types. Too. Yeah. Have we looked in all the trunks? Yeah, you have. All right. Let. What do you say we keep going? Find some more rooms. Let's maybe check the skylight by camp first. Uh, you've got a few more hours, you know. Okay, you're still, cool. You're still pretty good. Yeah, let's keep. Let's keep. Let's keep going then. Okay. Uh, cool. Leota, you were still leading the way. Oh, are we not going to cycle back around? Um, this is still like you discovering stuff, like you yeah. found this. So, like, uh, oh, okay. your um, your seven roll still applies. Gotcha. You continue wandering down the hallway, and suddenly you you smell something. Like it's a heavy stench. 
stench of like hmm. rotting wood and paper. Hmm. Yuck. You smell that? Mm-hmm. Does it smell like old books almost? It smells really bad. <laughs> it doesn't smell good. I don't know if I'd say it smells horrible. Well, let's figure out what it is. You follow... I, it's probably not good treasure, but... <laughs> you follow your sniffer into a, into a room where the ceiling is actually partially caved in. A little bit of a stream sort of trickles down through the side of this room. A lot of it's overtaken by moss. However, the Ooh. rest of it is littered with books and bookshelves. Yeah. Most of them meeting, uh, meeting a poor fate at the hands of rot and moisture. Jasmine? However, uh, tree roots uh, seem to lurch down from the sky above, Jasmine. keeping this room together. Um, you can see the surface from here. If you exited, you'd oh. probably uh, find your way out through a small ravine. Cool. Let's search the room, and then wow. we can maybe yeah. have back. We could camp up there it's if a we shame do. Of, it's a but, shame about the books, but yeah. this is a very pretty room. Jasmine, well, I tug on maybe, Jasmine's sleeve. Maybe some of them yeah. are okay too. We should check. Yeah. Can what's I, up, with them? Is it safe to put this in my nose? I hold up the mint. Huh? That's actually a really good idea. See, it pays off to hold on to things and not just eat them all at once. Wow. <laughs> I stick the mint in my nose. <laughs> okay. Are you guys going to search this room? Hello. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Uh, give me int plus dex. Everyone? Uh, yeah. <laughs> You're going to want to succeed on this one. My int oh. is oh, very okay. low. So maybe Quithub should dance. Maybe Leona's just fine. <laughs> okay. Uh, no, you uh, you immediately go into the room. Yes. And Leona... Wow, that's about right. I just find a book. I find a book and just get entertained by pulling it apart. Oh. <laughs> just kind of sit jumps down. out. Yeah. Leona, you um. You search the room, and, like, honestly, it seems like you kind of have an eye for artifacts based on what's happened so far. Mm. Broomtail comments to that effect immediately. Wow, you seem to be really good at this. <coughs> Actually, better than me at this. Oh, wow, thanks. I don't know about that. You know, this is kind of only the very first ancient ruin that we found. I'm Leota, sure you'll find says, Leota says, looking over her shoulder while pulling back an incredibly valuable-looking book. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, what wow. happened over there? I don't know. It's an old book. I can't quite make out the title, but I think this is leather. It's really nice. You um, do you pop it open? Hell yeah. Okay. Uh, in the first few pages are paper dolls, actually, very similar to the ones that Broomdale gave you. However, these don't have the weird eyes on them. <laughs> that's well. That's kind of weird. Oh, um, uh, uh, Jasmine, could you take a look at these? Yeah, what uh, what kind of book you got? Uh, give me an intelligence plus intelligence roll. Okay. Until further notice, I'm just gonna be sitting down and like pulling books apart. <laughs> oh boy, that's just awful. <laughs> uh, you're just you're equivalently bamboozled as everybody else. I it's got dolls in it, I guess. These kind of look like. That, these look like that charm you gave me. Oh, oh, yeah, they that's, do. That's actually a good point. Um, drawing back from the same source. Uh, let's let's read the book. The three kind of sit down oh, and like. Yeah, that's probably flip the best into... way to find out. <laughs> uh, you start looking through the book. It's in completely indecipherable text. Uh, give me an intelligence plus intelligence, Leona. Indecipherable as in. Another I have. Language. Can I oh, use? Yeah. Can I use World Eye to do this? Yes, actually. Oh, nice. Cool. That sounds cool. So I have an ability called World Eye, which lets me. Well, it says that it says it lets me communicate with others regardless of language barriers. But I think I'd like to argue that I can use it to at least partially decipher texts as well. It's um yeah. Um, the idea of World Eye as a wanderer is always welcome. Places. So, taking a peek at this book, I'm gonna like. This is a very proper application of the ability. Um, mm -hmm. Taking a look at this book, its overall organization, you can discern its usage. This is 
a chronicle. Like you're used uh, you're used to history books, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera, but this is almost uh-huh. framed like like a diary, but more hmm. fancy. You can tell through the filigree on the pages that this is a very important book. Furthermore, you know what language this is, or you have a basis for what language this is. Mm-hmm. Ariart gave you a book earlier that contained a foreign script near the beginning. This text actually matches that foreign script. Ooh. Guys, I think this is really important, and I think I might be able to decipher some of it. Really? Wow. Okay. Well, you're maybe. just collecting we'll books, huh? <laughs> That, that's great. So, this this is probably an artifact, right? This is definitely I mean, I think an artifact. so. It definitely looks like it. Wow. You've should got an eye for this. Thank you. Should, should we take this back to camp? Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> that is a crit fail. <laughs> what were you using Ooh. that for? The, oh, I thought I had to roll in plus spirit for world eye. Oh, um, no, no, no. Like, normally, yes, but no. Not in this case. You're okay. fine. Right um, I, I yeah, didn't I can't that. make much of it right now. We should take it back to camp and look at it there. Okay. Mm-hmm. Are you guys good? Should we set up camp on the surface, or should, should we camp out in the... Camping out in the ruin's been my dream. We should camp out in the ruin. Like... Oh, that sounds really that cool. Sounds, I've never even thought that that could be a thing that I could do. You all are huddled yeah. around the book, and, like, like Brimtail's just pushing in closer. Come on, let's go camp in the ruin. All right. Okay. All right. <laughs> we'll go camp. We're gonna camp in the ruin. <laughs> follow the soap crumbs. <laughs> <laughs> you follow the soap crumbs back just as the skylight begins to grow dim. Like it's it's now painted a um it's now painted a pinkish hue. Uh, oh, while we're going around, I'm also I should have mentioned this. I'm I'm gathering any scrap wood that I can find to make sure that we have uh, wood for the fire throughout the night. Ooh, perfect. I am preoccupied with something. What are you oh. preoccupied with? What are you gonna... You'll find out. Oh. Uh, okay. <laughs> uh, the group heads back to the campfire. Um, you all sit down, and Leota gets to gets to work on um, translating or deciphering this book, I suppose. Um, I'm gonna make some tea. <sighs> oh, nice. Ooh. Some mint tea. Uh, hey, Quithup. Huh? Do you still have any of that mint? Yeah. I reach into my pocket, uh, kind of obscuring <laughs> something in one of my other hands. I reach into my pocket, shuffle around for a minute, and hand you a handful of mint. Thank you. you. Can I use it to make some tea for everyone? Oh, tea would be really good. Oh, great. I go and make some tea. <laughs> you, um, yeah, you begin brewing the tea, the steam rising up to the skies above. Your light casts great shadows on the uh, abandoned ruin on all sides, occasionally flicking towards the the feet of that giant in the corner. Overall, it's a it's a sort of eerie yet serene feeling to be camping in the middle of a a place so long forgotten. Uh, it it gives me goosebumps on my neck, but also hope in my heart. <laughs> you this are... is great. This is yeah. a great day. <laughs> You feel, uh, you do feel strangely at ease, and the night passes with an almost, like, ethereal, uh, it passes with an ethereal silence. Quit the, what did you roll? Uh, <laughs> as everyone was just kind of, like, drinking tea, Quithop was working on something the whole time. Uh, eventually I proclaim, look, I made us a friend! Uh, and I set oh. down in front of the fire a tiny lumpy fox that I made out of the faux paper mache from Aww. the moldy books in the other room. Aww. Bucks. What? Bucks. Thanks. Bucks. Quit up, that's great! You made that? Just now? What's their name? What? What? You said you made us a friend. What's their name? It's a friend. Oh, I don't it's understand. a friend of a friend. It's our friend. <laughs> I. What do you mean a name? Well, you know but, how you're like, called you call them. Yeah. And I'm called the Otta? I don't know why we're called that, though. Oh. No, that's well, just so that's... people can tell us apart. And if you want to speak to one person specifically, oh, you then say let's, their name, right? Then let's call it friend. <laughs> we'll call it friend, then. <laughs> yep, that sounds, sounds like a good name to me. 
Uh, Broomtail's kind of, like, watching over your shoulder consistently, Liotta, as you, like, work on the book. <laughs> I'm, like, scribbling scribbling notes whenever I manage to make a connection somewhere. I have, like, a few pages in the journal devoted to this. Uh, give me <laughs> Sorry, an intelligence Chad. plus intelligence check. Also, plus. Can do. Does... Uh, just... Ugh. That's fine. It's okay, I guess. No, I think no. I'll... Just, you know, asking. Does anyone want their tail combed or anything? <laughs> While I'm here. <laughs> Broomtail, but... like, like, almost absent-minded. It doesn't seem to impact Broomtail that uh, you're hinting at her. <laughs> she kind of mm. looks over at Quiffa and kind of smiles. Like, looking at his tail. Well, my tail's very soft. <laughs> could, could I touch it? Sure. I bap you with it. <laughs> it is very soft. <laughs> Do you want me to comb it? Sure. Okay. Jasmine you... is excited, but she hides it. You spend uh, it, it's really it wags, bucks. It wags <laughs> in your grasp while Quitha plays with friend. Bucks. <laughs> bucks. It goes on um, till about like yeah no this goes on for a few hours actually like. Before you realize it, it's actually pretty late at night. How late, you're not entirely sure, because you're beneath the surface. Um, however, uh, eventually, Liotta stands up, suddenly reaching a breakthrough with her translation. Asleep. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got something? I, I get it! Yeah, no, I think I, I, well, I mean, I, I don't have it word perfect or anything, but I have a lot of the really important words and terms. <gasps> wow. Oh, is it time for a late night story? Uh, Broomtail, like, moves over back. it's time back, for a late night story. Uh, sits next Ooh. to Jasmine in front of the fire and, like, in front of, um, in front of Liotta, like, eagerly awaiting this. Yeah, Jasmine's <laughs> just sitting there with, like, her arms around her knees. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Liotta. What you got for us? Liotta looks down at her translated <clears throat> page. And God. And begins to read aloud the translated story. Now, this <laughs> is the exact point where I'm calling this session to a close. Because oh. you've discovered a piece no, of I think the I know why. Yeah. You've discovered yeah. a piece <laughs> of the lost history. Meaning yes. that the next session will be played in Tenra Boncho Zero. Oh, no. Tenra oh, Boncho Zero. Tenra Boncho Zero. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. That's wow, so cool. that's gonna be That's such whiplash. Like a nice cute little ending to this yeah. and like such a hype uh, lead in to I something totally these. different I love these so much I know, <laughs> I know. That was awesome. oh man yeah no oh. you uh over the course of this story you do realize for people who are familiar with Tenra Bancho Zero <laughs> that what um what Broomtail <laughs> discovered was called a Makio Soul Mirror and that's oh, all I'm going to no. say. Holy crap. Okay. <laughs> no! Wow. Oh. Oh. oh, no. I remember. Okay. Oh. I don't. Yeah, no, you're right. You're yeah, in I remember street that street next time, Jackson. Blissfully okay. ignorant. Oh, man. Yeah, <laughs> Always no. gonna be good. So please <laughs> join us next time for oh, Tenra mm. Bancho Zero, colon, Before Wandering. <laughs> we'll workshop oh, it. Yes. Yeah, that's, <laughs> yeah, that's the thing. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, everyone, for coming yeah, and joining sure. us on our, yeah. like, chill our chill stream you, because the next one is, you? is it's yeah, gonna be but... <laughs> it's gonna be yeah it's it's no. gonna be part of the ancient histories um which means it's played, so much fun yeah it's played in a different game system i didn't expect to play tbz before golden sky stories and like the proper <laughs> stream rotation <laughs> yeah. but no this is this is good <laughs> i i'm Sweet. very i'm very excited for this this is honestly yeah. like such a boon in my life it is it is such a like a a relaxing thing to do that just is yeah, good for us all. Yeah. That was like that was such it's a very, such a nice, nice relaxed chill session. Yeah, I, awesome. I loved that so much. 
Oh, uh, man. Yeah. Well, thank you for running that. Yeah, no problem. Yeah, um, thank you for, like, starting this whole... What have you? Yeah, I love I, this. I love this campaign. I'm going to switch over to chat so I can at least see chat before we... Uh... Yeah, and of course, thank you to all of our amazing patrons for making this possible. Yes. Mm-hmm. Yes. Thank you, yes, and thank you all a... chat for showing up to watch. Yeah, yeah, this was a patron nice. goal that we met mm-hmm. to be able to do this, so thank you so much. We did it. Yeah. We love that we can do it, and we hope that you're going to have as good a time as us. You yes, better. Indeed. Um, Whoa. <laughs> what? Yeah, no. So, Jackson, this will be your first time with PBZ. It will. Oh, oh my god, right. that's right. Oh, yeah. wow, I didn't even realize. I, uh... Fun times. <laughs> yeah. I'm excited. Watch a lot of Dragon Ball Z to, like, get ready for it. Or oh, you don't have to tell me to watch anime. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> well, that, I'm feeling, like, good inside. This is strange. Yeah, right? <laughs> for like the first hot... time in years. It's an onsen <laughs> for the soul. You nerd. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, chat brings up a good point that um, in the last uh, TBZ session, which did determine canon for this, the sun was split oh. multiple times. And yeah, there were three suns. Oh. Yeah, there are multiple celestial suns oh. in the sky. Uh, How about that? One is named the third okay. sun. The first sun? I can't remember exactly it's what the third. It it's... It's the third son. The third son. Oh, can one of can one of them be the prodigal son? Uh, <laughs> no, not yet. Sorry, <laughs> the legends are even set. Um, yeah, like this will help determine world lore, which is my favorite thing. <laughs> it's so cool. I love that it's like the age of heroes, and yeah. it's ten Ravancho zero. Those goofsters. The new son. That's it. <laughs> yeah, that's what mm. it is. <laughs> and it's spelled S O N. Uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So yeah, we're jumping back next time to the Age of Heroes. Hopefully, getting a history of what happened to this rock known as Wayward before Wayward was Wayward. Sweet. I am eager. Yeah, I'm yeah. excited. That should be wow. something interesting to say. The least. <laughs> something tells me I'm gonna have to like work hard to switch the gears I I'm in. It's... Like, I'm going to need all the time possible yeah. to be able to... Penra, Penra Boncho Zero is something. It is <laughs> it's energy. pretty intense. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah. Hopefully, we'll see you guys next time um, for Tenra Boncho Zero. Cool. Probably. For Tenra Boncho Zero. Zero, zero, zero. 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 Have a nice night. Boss, you do that you do that you do the echo effect really well. <laughs>